tech break for eBay auction that uh, ended on 9-5-21. Uh, so uh, we're just up a little early and we'll probably just BS a little bit until we open. We're going to open at 2 o'clock. So we'll kind of, we get a, a notification. Uh, I don't know what this phone does. I'm an Apple guy. I heard, I heard it buzz and make That's some good. noise. Like Nobody's on the other anyway, right. so it doesn't matter. They probably like, are going <laughs> to tune out if they were. Uh, probably want to, is it too early to mention these potential bonus packs? Uh, no, it's a perfect time. Uh, so you can show them off. So you can talk about them, what you want for these. Um, yeah, I'm going to bring this up. Let's see if we, we get. Oh, I'm going to drop my. I'm going to bring this up. Drop my volume with this. Is there um, a way to give you a thumbs down on your own video? Right? <laughs> there we go. Now I can watch the, the comments. Um, yeah, they're just. Uh, they're they're Donruss uh, Basketball 2021 uh, Fat Packs. They're 15 bucks a piece. I'll be selling them after, uh, after the break. For um, uh, and if you, I'll, I accept Venmo and um, PayPal, either or. So you just need to pay for ahead of time. Uh, message me on the chat. I'm uh, I'm monitoring the chat right, chat right now. So um, all you have to do is shoot me a message, and we'll get you on. We'll just send it. Uh, I'm not going to charge any additional shipping for them. They just whatever they are, they are. 15 works, and we'll just put them in with whatever. My role is to rip packs here. Hopefully, you guys get good stuff. Historically, I don't do particularly well ripping packs <laughs> for myself. But Maybe for other people. Yeah, <laughs> I, so hopefully, best of luck there. I mean, if I was in on this, I would pull every common card there was, and everything that you see on the boxes of getting short prints or inserts that probably wouldn't happen either <laughs> right i just i just over. i've been skunked pulling cards pretty much my whole life i've been what 80s that's probably i mean we haven't known each other that long but 80s is that when you started that's when i started i started ripping? like uh i remember like the first card i ever got was an 81 or was it 80, 1980 Rick Sutcliffe rookie? Uh, I thought you were going to say Rick Honey. <laughs> no, Rick, a Rick Sutcliffe rookie. And I remember I was probably, I was really young. I was, oh my God, this is so awesome. I can remember getting allowances at times. You know, you could go up and get a couple packs of cards for a buck at the time. And oh, Well, what year was that? Like that must have been late 80s. I don't know. I mean, Tom Thumb was still around. <laughs> uh, comic books were a thing. Yeah, I mean, they were like 25 or 35 cents a piece. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So yeah, that would have been probably mid 80s. 80s, 85, 86. The first time I actually actively remember collecting was the 87 tops. So you think any of these people listening, right? I know they're probably not all from Minnesota anyway, but I can remember walking into Schindler's, which is a kind of a big card store down here. And God, was that the holy grail of cards yeah, and Schindler's was great. Um I when uh, I like I would go into Schindler's. And they used to have those like a box that you'd buy, like a card box, and it would have like random packs. And I would take right. whatever my money was, like allowance or my job money, and buy it up. <laughs> Looking back, that was terrible because those packs were garbage. Well, every 80s card was garbage. Right. It was actually the weird thing was like like the what are the what are they called? Slurpees at 7 Eleven or oh, the Ice yeah, Caesar. The coins. Those little coins and discs are more rare than the cards. Yeah. I, I love those, man. Those at that and um, what were some of the other ones? Uh, KB from, toys cards, Kmart cards. Kmart it's cards. Like, good lord! And at the end of the day, those are probably more harder to come by than they still. They don't hold too much value. Well, yeah, but when you're talking five cents compared to one cent, do you remember the? They were like fake. It was like what was it called? Um, uh, like uh, not not beef, but like beef jerky. Beef oh, jerky this, tins, yes, and in the tin you would get, <laughs> yeah. uh, you would get a baseball card. Yep. So I used to buy that stuff, thinking you're all cool because you bought some jerky chew. Yeah. Um, and get the get the baseball. I'm trying to remember because I had mini cards stuck in like uh, Cracker Jack boxes. Oh yeah. Such. The best one though, Denny's holograms. Yeah. The Denny's the Grand holograms, Slam man. holograms. Yeah, the Grand Slam holograms. I I begged my mom to go so I could get the Herbeck. 
Did you get it? I did. I did get the her back. Do you have the begging or like you just uh, so you had to go? It was a pack they got. It was a oh, pack. so you didn't get to pick the card or anything. It was one was card. So you went to Denny's three times in one day. No, just <laughs> it was it was like a promotion that lasted for a while, and I was like. I finally like was able to convince them to to go a couple times. I know that this probably you'd remember this, and it's not baseball related. But remember when the St. Paul PD would drive around and give you Vikings cards? Heck yeah, so I, would, was, I would ask them for them. Running halfway out the street and getting run over by a cop. To they get must some have hated that crap. <laughs> they must have totally hated well, I that. I wonder if that would even work in today's age. Like, you think it would? We're not going to get like crazy political, but like I think that to some degree that would probably help improve some like right, relations uh, between the community and i think you're probably right i i don't know why they don't do that anymore other than licensing but these weren't licensed cards were they well they had I don't they had vikings players they had vikings logo on it you know i well, mean it wasn't that long ago that they, they yeah licensing had... i suppose is way different today than it was then so yeah you could be onto something i don't honestly know the answer to that um it wasn't that long ago that like fox fox 29 who who like did some baseball like fox would do like the baseball of the oh, week sure. and they actually released some twins cards but they were classic twins cards i don't think they were current players yeah. um I'm kind of sad no everything cost a buck to create something for enjoyment value that yeah you have to you know make sure that everybody gets their cut but i would imagine most cities around the country would have done something similar at the time i mean we had vikings cards like i would think that would exist well being a tony gwynn clerk i'm sure you you have that list right i'm sure they're on there like the oh yeah, uh, that's the thing. It's like Smokey the Bear cards. Were Smokey like the Bear thing. cards, it's yeah. Like, uh, what's are, that? Was it Turkey Red or whatever? Something it was? like that. I probably have the card, but I haven't sadly looked at my cards. I know my Herbert collection. I have you know um, probably five hundred different cards, and all these goofy. Crazy well, it's funny. Cards. Like when we were talking the other day, I worked overnights at one period, and it created an Excel spreadsheet, and I would go through and highlight the ones I had. I probably had uh, several hundred pages there. And yeah, that well, stopped in 2001. Could you imagine how many pages I'd have to add to this checklist? I know, right? Like, And I'm a Herbeck collector, so Herbeck has a ton. And nowhere near like Gwen. Well, you yeah. know? And that's the thing. is there's That was always what was difficult because, obviously, in the 80s, you knew there was basically Topps, Fleer, and Donruss. Right. So then when Until you get these little subsets. 1988. And it was that score. That, score came okay, in. And, and then, like, exact, sports right, flicks and yeah, crap so, like that. But, yeah, I mean, unless you knew, I had no idea that Denny's would have a Tony Gwynn card or mm -hmm. a sect of their own or that they considered the card of a starting lineup as part of this. Like, it kind of went in a direction where it was, I've never heard of this. How yeah. do I access it? And then eBay... Obviously, that was where it changed, that. like where you could find all these cards. And I haven't been to, but Beckett Marketplace was always a good way to do it because it gave you access to like some random card shop in the middle of San Diego or something or a yeah. surrounding community where they would have obviously more of that stuff. To find those really... Well, it's um, crazy. Those uh, bobbleheads over your shoulder there on the far left and the right are made by a company that got destroyed in a hurricane i believe sam or sam or i don't know what they call it but those are not easy to find so like collectibles back then like you had your basic stuff and then it's like how did we even find out that there were all these other little things yeah, right. or that they might have been worth money unfortunately most of that stuff is garbage though it's just not worth a thing you know it's not worth anything <laughs> They but it drives so you nuts when you're the collector that doesn't have that one. I know, right? Like, yeah, but you think like, why should I waste my time spending two dollars or, you know, to get that uh, weird like <laughs> RC can or you know, <laughs> like yeah. I have like the like uh, remember the 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 old seventies RC cans had yes, players on them on the back. I have a Harmon Killer Brew beer. I think it's a beer can or an oh, oil really? can or something. <laughs> and I used to love like when I used to go to autograph shows. To get players to sign weird, goofy crap, and I have I have that oil can or whatever okay. it is signed by. Pardon me, signed by Killebrew. My still one of my favorite memories is it's probably what been 10, 15 years, and we're strolling through Twins Fest, and it was at the Dome, 
And I'm yeah. like, I bet you don't have this signed by Kent Herbeck. And you start laughing. I'm like, oh, God, what? You pull it on your little poster <laughs> thing that you're carrying around. I'm like, of course you do. That was that, like, licensed painting. <laughs> it was still funny, though, because it was one of the more odd things I've ever seen. And, uh, and, and you had it. I, I, I absolutely, yeah, that was, I, I remember that. That was one of the things. I still haven't gotten it signed. Because remember, he canceled that day because of, uh, yeah, somebody was, was he was either he was sick or somebody was sick or he couldn't he had to leave, which I mean that happens. But I can remember like because he was supposed to you went up to go get it signed why, uh, me and another guy walked around and then you came back I'm like damn that was quick and you were just the look on your face was like <laughs> I mean look, I, I don't <laughs> you didn't cry but like that was what it seemed like it was going towards and but, it's like you don't get your heroes around it's like no. Oh, well, and I mean, let's be honest. I mean, do you know how many uh, how many autographs I have? Probably hundreds. H- hundreds. Thousand, of, I was going to say, if you yeah. say a thousand, that might be a little bit excessive. Uh, well, at one point, he was at a Cub Foods. I had heard from somebody I was in line for for some autograph, and he had told me that Herbeck was going to be at the opening of a Cub Foods in Stillwater. And so I'm like, oh, my God, I'm going to this. And I call my cousin up and I collect everything I have Kerr back up, right? <laughs> and I go down there and we wait in line. He was there for four hours and we wait in line. He got through the line in an hour. And then there was only like stragglers coming in here and there. Well, we went through the line again. And the second time through, Herbeck was there and I asked him, I said, Mr. Herbeck, I, do you care? Would you mind if I go through the line more? He's like, no, it's your time. So we just start going through, and he signed everything. He was super nice. He actually, at one point, like, geez, you're like, you're like my stalker. <laughs> Sadly, you've probably carried that into your adulthood. So if you're getting anything out of this, kids watching, uh, don't do anything that he just described because it is a little creepy. Even to hear about it for probably the hundredth time. Right, right, but Herbeck was uh, Herbeck was totally cool. He was laying on. The thing about it was is that Cub Foods finally kicked me out. <laughs> <laughs> if you're not going to buy something, can not beat it. Right. How old were you at the time? Oh, this was, he probably had, he had probably just retired. Oh, so he probably talking 94 or 95, yeah. right? Because he retired in 94. So it would probably be about 94 is when. So you were retired. actually kind of an adult at that point. Yeah. Anyway. Was, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. For sure. But I mean, I was a fan. Like I was wearing a Herbeck jersey going in. You know, I mean, it's not like I was. Well, you just strike me as a guy that would go in and then forget to get the jersey signed. Like, damn it! Because <laughs> I got to meet. Well, I met him so many times that. You know. I, I feel like I remember one Twins Fest where you had something and I had to wait in line with you, and it's like it probably would have been the same as me. Roles reversed. If it had been Tony Gwynn, I'd have been giddy. And I'm like, you met this dude a thousand times, right? And I was just kind of like. God, I feel like I'm shopping for purses with my wife. Like, how is this exciting? And you get to meet uh, Herbeck. That's why it was exciting. Yeah, I mean, but for somebody that, full disclosure, did not like twins growing up, I was a Cardinals fan. And how I ended up on Tony Gwynn, probably because similar, like left handed hitter, pudgy like me. You know, so. Right, right. Well, I mean, it's weird because Tony Gwynn is like the. I mean, him and Herbert, or I mean, uh, Puckett. I mean, they're. I, think I just didn't like him because I just didn't even then like baseball wasn't my number one sport and hockey. Like you, you couldn't really watch it because I remember, like hockey, you actually had to watch them on pay per view. Do you recall that? So like you had cable, but I then remember you had watching to, like, a baseball on pay per view, but I don't ever watch. I don't remember ever watching. Uh, yeah, hockey was like that. Hockey, for they like had a hockey while, on pay per view. That's crazy. Um, well, we got about fifteen minutes till we'll start the opening. Um, I don't have uh, the list of names. Hey, <laughs> Tony, our, our buddy, my buddy Tony's on here. But the uh, guy that's supposed to hook me up with cards. He's he's watching. <laughs> showdown. Maybe we'll do a showdown thing. You can ask him right here, Tony. You want to sell your your showdown cards? I got about <laughs> eight bucks for you. <laughs> He's. I know he's got like a couple open or sealed boxes. That dude. Sadly, I probably have the Tony Gwynn one of those, but like. Right. 
They, they never, it was after 94, so... They you should ask him if he's got it there. Like, you think there was a machine, and I think that was exclusive to football. I think it was exclusive. No, I think you're right. I think you're right. Um, I, we, up, remember, we played it, you know? He's got the scanner, but hey, the Joseph. scanner's just for football, right, Tony? That's why I remember it. And yeah, I think you're right. I, I just remember it never worked. <laughs> it said sealed and the scanner. Tony, well, let's ask, Tony, did it have a... Uh, he said it yeah, a just, scanner for for baseball or just football? Was I that? I think it? it was just football, and I think that's what he's confirming is that. He said, "Right, but right, but was it for did baseball work on the scanner too, or was it just football?" When are you ripping? Uh, two o'clock. Two o'clock. Yeah, it was one more. Is this we'll Joseph, the guy that bought half your auctions? Uh, just football. Got just it. football. Never tried. Never tried. Yeah, yeah I mean, you it, never tried it. Never worked. It work. So it didn't matter. This is probably like the ET version of sports cards, like the old Atari game. Like you couldn't win at it. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I don't remember the. I have to look on eBay to see. To, no, to I was it. kidding. I just assumed because you told me somebody won half these auctions. So well, there was. I just I, I I have to look to see the names. I didn't ram down. Like um, again, or I I don't know if I've sent you an email or not. This is my or our first rip ever. Um, pretty excited about it. Um, it's, it's, if I can like consistently get product, obviously I'm not making money off this at all. Cause I definitely am not, this is a, almost a break even type thing, but it's fun. So if I can do more of it, I will. Uh, uh, Tony, I remember they sent those, uh, black and white cards to everybody because the foil cards created nothing but issues with that scanner yeah it didn't work <laughs> no and so that's why he got that black and white set and i feel like i had it for a while and like i'm never gonna use these right yeah that's that's a big thing is uh it wouldn't work <laughs> <laughs> well you... i thought the idea of the game was kind of innovative at the time and i just remember being so heartbroken that it wouldn't work the way you wanted it to cause... how did they not have like play test why didn't they play test the yeah, game? Because they're the first company that's ever created something that's innovative. EA Sports can't make a Madden game in 2021. Right. So. But I play, like I'm a big board gamer. When I when I play these board like uh, independent board games, they play these games over and over. So there's a reason they have certain rules. But set do they up. mass produce them at a time where mass production probably superseded quality? You just think that they would have like check to see that the scanner worked you know? yeah well it probably worked three times i'll just keep hey, yeah that works we're good <laughs> what did tony say uh, they see. include rookies and chase cards weren't those additional sets though i feel like those. oh were... yeah no they didn't have rookies and tra chase cards they should have oh you're talking we, about tony and i talked about that the showdown game yeah or? because showdown didn't have like one of the big draws is your rookie card or oh, your right. chase card you know, I mean, even if you're playing Magic the Gathering or Pokemon, there are chase cards, and people want those chase cards. You know, if you had that parallel Derek Jeter, that thing would have been worth money. You and know? if you pulled that in a Pokemon pack, I'd say what that would be. <laughs> I'd like to see that in a Pokemon <laughs> pack. Uh, so we have we have two on right now. Um, again, I'll, t I'll tell you again, I don't know how many we only have. Oh, we have four on. Okay. Uh after the games or after the baseball pack, if anyone is uh, interested in uh, Don Russ 2021, uh, these are the fat packs with the bell, uh, the ball rookie in it. Uh, I'm just selling them for 15 off just straight, and uh, I'll include them with your shipping. Yeah, what do you get digital packs for? Like, this I, is I, how far I digital cards are a big thing, man. They're well, it looks like it's you get of... 10 free digital packs with this code. Yeah, well, I've never opened so a pack yet. There's so... a code there, so I don't know how if you're going to get that code to somebody or what, if anything, you do with it. Yeah, that part I don't I don't know. I've never done it, but we'll we'll mention it again just before. Or we'll just include the pack and the sh sh no, we we send it out. It. Yeah. Oh, yeah, send the wrapper. That's fine. I'll send the wrapper back. I don't know. Like I said, I don't know anything about it. But if they're that lucrative, I guess I'd probably want in on it. I I haven't opened basketball. Um, it, I just happened to like was able to pick them up. At, Trust me, the it, there's going to be about seven people when we rip these baseball packs that I'm going to have heard of. Uh you may know more than you. I mean, you know Scherzer. Yeah, no Kershaw. Yeah, what? Well, well, yeah, but those are guys that have probably played for 15 years. Yeah. Now. 
And you'll still, I mean, obviously Mike Trout's still in the league, and he's hurt He's hurt this year. He's been hurt the whole year, hasn't he, for the most part? For a part of it. Obviously, the Otani is what everybody is, really. The, 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 the Angels players or the Angel fans are the ones that want that one. Um, I, mean, I don't think you need to be an Angels fan to want an Otani card right now. He's the only reason, sadly, I tuned in to watch the All-Star game because I'm not. The irony here is that Tony Gwynn's my favorite athlete ever, and I don't really like baseball now because I don't <laughs> like know many of the players because I watch hockey. But the interesting part is is tuning in to just watch Shohei and then watching, like, there's a Guerrero. Right. There's a Bichette. There's a Tatis. Like what? Yeah, all these, all these. Uh, that's a, that's the weird part. Is these are the kids of players we watched when we were young. You know. Right. Yeah, that's crazy. It's so weird to me. Um, we got. We'll start ripping here in about ten minutes. Um, have you seen the meme? Just switching gears on you because I can't talk about Tony Gwynn quite enough. But you've seen the meme where they talk about the Braves pitchers in their prime: Maddox, Smoltz, Glavin. and Glavin. How the three of them combined struck out Gwyn three times. So <laughs> I see that meme pop up quite a bit on Facebook. And it's like, why do you even include Maddox? Because he's never struck out Tony Gwynn. Like, why do you include him in a meme that he shouldn't be part of? I mean, well, no. Smoltz was a strikeout guy. Glavin kind of. But Maddox would pile up. He wasn't known for, like, he was never going to get you 20 in a game. But he was a guy that would pile up. Seven to nine, which for a guy like that was pretty good. I mean, yeah. You think about an eighty-eight mile an hour pitcher, and with no athletic skills, <laughs> I <laughs> feel like I could get a hit off Maddox. But it's probably like no, I would have struck out before I even got to the plate. Yeah, Avery was the bomb. Everybody Avery had like two good years though. Like after those two years, because I collected his cards, even though I hated the Braves. But wasn't he like a late season call call up that just hit fire in the playoffs? Because I don't remember him. No, he doing played much that whole. That he played he? that whole year. Okay. Um, he was he was good. He was really good. I remember like everybody wanted his cards. He just turned out to be junk. Then then he signed with like Boston or somebody. Uh, right he there? went yeah, somewhere and know. crashed. And it was like Pete Smith was another one of the Pete Braves. Smith. He was like the last <laughs> of the Brave, like Pete Smith. Pete Smith. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, yeah, getting uh, uh, on another topic, like just getting a hold of baseball cards nowadays, it's freaking crazy hard. Like getting, like accumulating these cards to just do a break for fun was tough, you know? Yeah, I, when like, he says that, I had no contributing factor in that. Yeah, I, I like, I have to. I was this. just kind of on him, like, dude, I want to rip these open. I want to rip these open. He's like, <laughs> I don't know if, what I want to do. And I, I don't even, I, you probably, one of us probably just inadvertently blurted out box break. And you're like, yeah, that'd be cool. And like, well, I want to rip. So. <laughs> well, I knew my YouTube channel had enough. Uh, I've had over a thousand fans or a thousand subscribers. So. Um, well, I don't know. After you talked about stalking her back, you might be losing fandom there. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> um, but this, and we did do it one practice, but I've never done a live and I've, I've kind of wanted to do the live and I wanted to do a break. No, there you go. So. So I'm here for comedic value, so I'm sure you're going to lose viewers there. Well, no, we only lose viewers if we show your face. Well, <laughs> trust me, I'm not tuned in for that either. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I'm hoping for for some big... I, I would love to just pull one that's just a mega one just because... An awesome I, one. Even if it's not my card, and that's fine. I'm not really invested in this, but it's still cool to pull somebody that awesome. I and sadly, like I said, I'm a little bit removed from sports card collecting, baseball specifically, because I just don't do baseball and don't know the players much. But like, is there anything in here that would warrant like a I mean, thousand it's always, dollar card or something? Oh, thousand. I mean, those are pretty hard. But uh, you know, if you get an Otani signed card, I I haven't seen the checklist for all this stuff. Um, Bowman will have. I mean, a lot of these. Like what I would buy for is for the rookie cards. Oh, sure. Everybody wants the rookie cards, you know, getting rookie autographs, rookie. It's everything is rookie cards. I mean, every rookie is going is going to at least get a penny sleeve, if not like get a hard case because rookies are just. See, I'm looking at these boxes and I'm guessing on the far left, is that Juan Soto for Washington? Yeah. And see uh, that box in front of it. I couldn't tell you who those guys are at all. Those are you. I can't. I can't see. Is that uh, there's a Philly there? I'm sure somebody will that tell doesn't us look like. 
but it doesn't look like uh, Harper. And see, I'm like, I know nobody. Like Harper's having a killer year. Does he year. finally? Yeah, he's having an awesome year. Um, I, I mean, I'm happy about that. Another I shouldn't one. say finally because he's a good player, and I do like. He's him. always been a good player, but he. I don't know. I always look at it from okay, you're batting two sixty and you got hundred and sixty strikeouts. How good are you? No, it's it's all about like you'll have a hard and some RBI. And you don't hear about him hardly ever. Like so I don't watch baseball, but I'll box score watch because yeah. you know, oh, I always check that. Like especially even up in the But I don't check because like, I don't even know how long he's been with Philly. At least a few years. Now, yeah. Right? I've been buying um buying some of these box breaks and just to see. I mean, everybody wants Tatis. Everybody wants, you know. Uh, Guerrero and uh, Vladdy is he's in Toronto too, right? Yeah, um, Bichette. Didn't that where isn't that where the Twins he's just traded too. a guy, their pitcher, their young pitcher? Didn't they trade him to Toronto for some prospects? Who did for Rios, maybe? Yeah, oh, I forgot where they traded him to. I'm glad, I'm, <laughs> I'm glad sure he'll kept, win 30 games a season there. I'm glad we kept, uh, I know some people <laughs> don't, I know Tony doesn't like Donaldson, <laughs> I like Donaldson. Like after watching like his life story just recently, um, I was I I really liked Donaldson a lot. Um, I feel like with Tony's knowledge, we should just refer to him as Stat Boy. Tony, Tony, <laughs> Tony's the guy that like worked at the card shop and and would buy all the product and keep it sealed. <laughs> I've seen stuff you've got in your house, and I don't feel like you're too far behind. Ah, uh, but I, I could never keep like having these baseball cards sealed, and I'm I sold them is. Insane in my world. I should have. I normally have that. The fact that you them, it's like, uh, I think that's why I started working. I'm like, I need, I still, as much as I don't collect, it's like, I see them and it's like, oh God, I just, I, I'm actually a little bit uh, nervous about ripping something, pulling something really good. And that's what sucks me back into this All right. hole for myself. <laughs> um, and, and a lot of places, like, I, uh, it, number one, it's hard to get the cards. Number two, like some of the places you go, even like what's that stupid sports place in Mankato? Um, Shields? Shields sells them, but they they jack you the guys prices not up. Have a, you don't have a like a sports card place down mm-hmm. there anymore. Not anymore. You know, double play changed to pulp, so there's no there's no sports. Because the guy place. we both know, I'm gonna give a throw out to Nick Wasica. For those that don't know him, he's a photographer, and Beckett just did a thing. Um, <laughs> Of talking about like I well yeah yeah uh that my my uh my story with nick waska is he's uh, if you guys yeah don't know he's a photographer for tops i think sports, or upper deck sports maybe. in general um does he just had like an article in beckett beckett right um i introduced him the hockey to hockey beckett right oh yeah yeah i introduced him to his wife <laughs> His, I'm sure he'll love to have heard that on your. Uh, he knows that. I, know. <laughs> I every time I see him, no, I'm like, he, he's a good dude. I'm the guy that did that. Remember that, <laughs> and and his wife Anna is just awesome. She's. I saw her at a, a concert a couple of years ago. I ran into her. All of a sudden, she was there, and I kind of was. I was like, Anna, did you <laughs> stalk like, her like you did her back. There's stories, <laughs> but we don't, we're not we're not we're not de- de- divulging any stories on this one. Tony just said he slowed down on the sports cards after getting into Magic. Dude, that guy, he's got like, he's got like a bunch of uh, LeBron rookies too. Really? Yeah, he sold, that, sold one that long ago for a crap ton of money. So when did LeBron come in? 01, 02? So like, well. he would have at least been kind of the new era ushered in where at least they didn't have the 87 tops and there were 80 million of them out there. Right. Um, we're going to start here in a minute. You know, which or I do the Bowman I'm Bowman's start, last. But... I'm going to start with these unless the uh, go start with the we have, Yeah, okay. just we'll because they're there. bigger. There was there so many of those. One yeah. pack in there, twenty cards. Twenty cards. Yeah, so. Should give you that stupid box. Uh, again, I'm just going to let you guys know we do have uh, after the break. Uh, if anyone wants a uh, a Donruss uh, uh, basketball fat pack, I have them. They're fifteen dollars. I'll just throw them in with your no no additional shipping. Uh, I'll, I accept Venmo or uh, PayPal. Just shoot me a message on on the chat, and I'll uh, I'll hook you up if you're if you're interested in it. Otherwise, I'll probably try and collect some more basketball. Maybe we'll do a basketball break. So, all right. Well, uh, it's two o'clock. You ready to roll? We're ready to roll. So, okay. oh, yeah. Make sure you, you show all the. It's we're sealed. sealed. <laughs> and trust me, I have zero desire to have any of these cards. I just, like I say, at this point, it's. 
kind of a countdown of nostalgia for me to rip you off of uh, off camera so, you're off camera so so where you just rip these open and I damage just cut, all I the just, cards just slice down the stump on in the front just right right across babe's face and then just rip yeah yeah everybody I'm a little bit nervous not that far in <laughs> oh no. jesus how about uh okay now we're off camera like that's going to be hard because i didn't realize that this plastic is so hard it could be that I have a dull knife too, but I'm certainly not going to blame myself. I'm blaming you. All right. What are we getting first? Who's going to be the first big one? I'm telling you guys, I don't uh, know names very well, so when I start mispronouncing them like some people do with hockey, uh, it could get entertaining real quick. As long quick. as you can pronounce Kov. Kov. <laughs> Kov? Kov. And so, of course, then they have to have another thing on here, but... Yeah, I always make sure you have to keep that in front of the camera. Sweet, who are we getting? All right. So, put that down. Flip them around. Here we go. Luis Robert. Keegan Aiken. I'll just flip them around because I don't care. Spencer Howard. Oh, I see. Yeah, there's, those are rookies. Like, when you see the rookies, we'll we'll pop them in a... Oh, okay. I'll, I'll just take it after go. you're done. George Sisler. George Sisler. That's a whole Oh, I like that Clemente card. He's probably just a common, but that's cool. Roberto Clemente. There's and, a Clemente? Oh, that's cool. Andy Young. Chris Bryant. Isn't he the yeah. elder player now? Yep. Jemai Jones. Joe Cronin. Joe Cronin. Louis Patino. Lou Gehrig. That's kind of an interesting box. Babe Ruth. Baby Ruth. This is an Eddie Stanky. That's who's kind the, of a cool the Diamond King? Like, That's what I want to see. Diamond, I'm going to get it wrong, but Kiebert Ruiz. Ruiz? That's cool. My legacy forgot. Oh, it's an ours proof. Oh, uh, like the, cool. This is? Yeah, oh, yeah. The, 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 uh, so, yeah, that's cool. We'll put these in top loaders for you. George yeah. Sisler. You got a kind of a Pete Alonzo. Oh, uh, the Ars Pelt? That's cool, too. I actually have no idea who he plays for. That's how bad I am. Matt. Alec Bohm. Bomb. Somebody. Uh, we got a Nate Pearson. That's kind of a cool Diamond Kings. Diamond Kings been around forever. Yeah, the Ars Pelt one. Was Eddie really Collins. Awesome. Uh, Roger Maris. So we start the 61 debate now. And then uh, Diamond King of... Ryan Castellini. So cool. I'll hand these off to you and let you start loading them up. I'll dive into the next box. Keep it on camera. Apparently I'm um, being graded on my you are. work here. So far you've maybe made a B. A B yeah, or a D. <laughs> I was going to say. Can't uh, steal your thunder on your channel the first time. So we have to like get into that. Uh, we'll definitely, um, uh, Penny Sleeve All Rookies, of course. Oh, I'll, I'll definitely Penny Sleeve that, uh, Clemente. That's pretty awesome. This week, uh, Just because I like him. Like, well, he doesn't like he's Clemente. a humanitarian, so, like, yeah, what's not to like? There's a lot of rookies in this pack. So we're just going to keep going while he sleeves. We got Aaron Judge. Like Aaron Judge? Okay. Ian Anderson, rookie card. Joey Votto. I like, I, I've always liked Votto. Braxton Garrett, rookie card. Babe. We got the Babe. You got Babe? Yeah. Nice. Dylan Carlson, rookie card. If you guys are, are not satisfied with the picture, just let me know. I'm trying to well, at least show you. Well... Keeping in mind the time that you don't probably want to spend all day with us, but that's yeah, fine. Right. Rogers Hornsby, Jose Ramirez. We got a Bobby Dahlbeck rookie card. We got a Cody Bellinger. Hey, Jackie Robinson, that's cool. Oh, Jackie, yeah, that's sweet. Another one of these die cut. Oh, I like that Shohei card. Whoever got the Angels? Who like, got the Otani? Uh, oh, it's a. Oh, it's the uh, the die cut. 
Yeah, that's the that's cool card. Awesome. I like that card a lot. That's going to be a top leather. And you got a Garrett Crochet, I'm going to guess. Artist Proof Rookie card. That's kind of a cool card. Yeah, Artist Proof wasn't... Uh, wasn't you nice. got a Mike Piazza. DJ LeMay. Why have I felt like I've heard of him? He's pretty good, right? Le DJ LeMayhew? Yeah. Uh, who's he play for? <laughs> uh, we got D JD Adele. Yeah, sure. And another JD Adele rookie card. We got Tristan McKenzie rookie card. Oh, Tris Speaker. Oh, Lemayhew is a Yankee, huh? Tanner Hoke. and a. Tristan McKenzie, Diamond King. That's a pretty cool card. Okay. Yeah. These are done. We got that Otani. Yeah, that Otani's in there. I like that card. I, that's why you take stuff away from the camera, so I can just take stuff. <laughs> that's kind of what we're trying to do here. Kicked. They get kicked, and you lose all credibility on your first day. Right. <laughs> and I have a Otani card to show for it, so... Actually, I have zero desire to keep the cards. Now, if that thing would have been signed, I would have been happy for whoever gets it. Oh, yeah, dude. I want to. I, 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 it would be so cool to pull, like, just something awesome. Yeah, something. Something. But that, that Otani is still, that's pretty awesome. That's the parallel. So. so, like, right away on this next pack here, we got a Mickey Mantle. So, whoever got the Yankees is putting together, like, they got the Yankees old school. Too. I'm sure these Yankees are not worth much, but still kind of neat. Yeah, anytime you get like those type of players, a Mickey Mantle, William Contreras rookie card. We got a Christian Yelich. Oh, Is he still good? Awesome. Jesus yeah. Sanchez rookie. Pete Rose. I always thought he was a left-handed here. Apparently not. Shane McClanahan of Tampa Bay rookie card. A Ty Cobb. A Miguel Cabrera. I'm going to just hope I get the name right. Braylon Marquez, rookie card. We got a uh, Kohei Arihara. This Otani has to be, I have to get the bigger. Bigger one? We'll, yeah, I, we'll dig it up after. Yeah. Alex Kirilov. Oh, yeah, Kirilov. Oh, twin. Yeah. Is he good, or are we going to ship him out soon? Rookie oh, card. I like him. You got a Garrett Crochet again, and that's one of those die-cut cards. Rookie, that's pretty cool. I like those cards. Yeah. Got another Roger Maris here. Ooh, Satchel Page. Satchel. Did you see that? That's a good, cool card. That is a cool card. I like Satchel oh, Page. He's one of my favorite uh, players I never uh, actually got to see. But uh, that's probably a story for another time that nobody cares about. Hey, that's boy, fine. Teddy Ball said, game. Ted Williams. Did you say you never right. saw Satchel Page play? Was I even alive? <laughs> no. <laughs> Sam Huff rookie card. San Diego Luis. Yeah, I'm going to just say camping something, rookie card. I thought you said that they had good players on San Diego. Andres Jimenez, Diamond King. Finish it up with Bell Ott and Carl Hubble. Is it Hubble? Carl Hubble. Hubble. Carl Hubble. So, Pretty solid player. Keep handing you stuff. We'll keep awesome. right on going. That, that mantle's awesome. Yeah, these are kind of... They almost have a canvas feel to them. Yeah, I, I like I like them. They're nice. Christian Yellick, that's cool. Yep, sorry. Took it off the camera. Try not to... It's going out there, huh? But, well, it's kind of, like, difficult to not do things that are natural to you. Right. Like, who puts their cards 50 feet away so that others can see them? I got it. You just know that there are definitely people out there that are sheep. You know, I'm not trying to do that. And like I say, peeps, my apologies. I'm trying to do everything on the up and up here. Do they have autographs in these or what? Uh, I don't, I don't know. Patch cards, anything? Like, are we like literally starting at the bottom of the barrel here? Because at some point... I, I honestly I've never I haven't opened any of this stuff so I feel like is... I just got no nope, I didn't uh, maybe there might be a jersey I feel like there's a thick card in there Christian Yelich Jesus oh. Sanchez Did you see that that Maris was an artist proof yeah I saw that That's that was a cool awesome. card and Pete Rose 
You need some sound effects too, like for hits when you're <laughs> like coming. Boom. Shane McClanahan, rookie card. Ty Cobb, Miguel Cabrera, Braylon Marquez, starting at Kohi Arihara, and the same Alexei Kirillov rookie card. Kirillov, yeah. And Aaron Judge. Yeah. All right, so this card here is something. Oh, oh it's, it's a, a dual cool. jersey Andres Jimenez card, or Jimenez. Jimenez? Oh, that's sweet. That's pretty cool. I like the artwork. And the Indians like didn't sell until like the last second. Uh, George cool Brett. Take that card, Brett. Uh, yeah, you can't go off camera though. No, you've already pulled it. So <laughs> just kidding. Camera just relax. I don't know how to pronounce that. Lucas Giolito, Rod Carew. That's a pretty cool, Cub. The Art of Hitting by Ichiro. Uh, Bob, I love Bob Gibson. He's probably my favorite pitcher. He and Pedro Martinez. That's like I think they would have been the greatest one-two punch in history. Ryan Mountcastle Diamond King card. Drew Garcia rookie. Nick Neidhart. Rookie Jim card. The Anvil? Yeah, I don't think it's the same guy. <laughs> or a relation Neidhart. at all. Neidhart. And then a Shane McClanahan. Whoever Shane McClanahan is, is gonna make if there's a fan out there, he's gonna make somebody happy because I feel like I've pulled plenty pulled of all those. The Shane McClanahan. All of them. There's gonna be no more in any of these boxes. <laughs> no more left. Do you have more of the pennies over there? Or are they down below? They're all down below. Well, why are we beeping? Somebody said something. They're pissed at you. Yeah, no, it wouldn't shock me. Woke up. <laughs> Damn it. We have You're to deal with it another again. day. <laughs> well, you're supposed to be monitoring all that. Like you can't and there's actually, like on my computer, there's actually a time delay. So I'm watching on two, I'm watching on my camera and on my, my other phone. To see the other, oh, one jersey card. At least there's somebody. I, I have no idea about the rest of it, but cards are cool, even though I know about one third of them. Kohi Arihara rookie card. Another one. Oh, Alex Kirilov for the same card in like three straight packs here. <laughs> Like, really? So we can't do better than this? And you get the, uh, the autograph? Aaron Judge. Ian Anderson, rookie. Joey Votto. Votto. Braxton Garrett, rookie card. Babe Ruth. Dylan Carlson, rookie. Rogers Hornsby. I kind of like the vibe here of, like, these old school players. Yeah. We'll Jose watch, Ramirez. Together. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Bobby Dahlbeck. And you, it looks like you always get one of these die cut in here. P yeah, Pete like, Alonzo. Uh, you remember like the cool. old one, like like the tops that would have a gold card in or artist proof Spencer Howard. Yeah, those were always cool. I like that DJ LeMahieu card. That's a really sweet one. You see this? Yeah, that's sweet. As I turn it to you away from the camera. No, I can see it in the camera. Who we got here? Francisco, Francisco Lindor. That's a pretty cool gallery of stars. Oh my god, oh, we got nine people on right now. Yeah, Christian hey Christian Posh, Christian Pache, rookie card. Sorry, I don't know the name. We got a Bobby Dahlbeck, Diamond King. That's pretty cool. Diamond King. Sandy Diamond King. Koufax. You got Koufax? Jeez. All these old school pitchers, man. We're like literally hitting by Mount Rushmore. Like I, we haven't pulled the Pedro, but that's a cool card. Pee Wee Reese. Pee Wee Reese. That's funny. That's Brooklyn Dodgers. I have, uh, I have a Pee Wee Reese uh, kids glove. Oh, really? It's really sweet. Kiebert Ruiz and Dalton Jeffries rookie card. Dalton Jeffries. That would seriously be my Mount Rushmore of. Pitchers. I don't know if I have a fourth yet, but Pedro. Yeah, probably Satchel Page. Pedro. Um, Bob Gibson. I think I'd win, get the intimidation factor there, and then you get Satchel Page in there with uh, Colfax. Did you think? I mean, I suppose it's all arguable at that point, but I, mean, I think that's a pretty good start to a conversation. You can make. I mean, there's a bunch of pitchers you can make. Uh, 
I'm sure there's people arguments that for love Randy Johnson. I mean, he was pretty damn scary. Yeah. Remember, uh, who was it? Uh, Joe, it was John, John Crucky. Crook. Yeah, John Crook in the All Star game put his head backwards. The cool Bo Bichette card. Oh, really? Let's see. Yeah, uh, just a normal base oh, card. It looks that's like the first one I've seen though. That's sweet. I suppose I don't need to turn it when uh, you can see it through the camera, eh? Yeah. Manny Machado. Manny Machado. Mickey Moniac or Moniac rookie card. I like Machado. We got a Christy Matthewson. That's pretty cool. Christy Matthewson. Yeah, that's cool. This is Lucas Giolito. Hey, look at that! Tony Gwynn! <laughs> you got Tony Gwynn? I just, whoever got San Diego, I'm just taking this. Um, I, <laughs> I, I wouldn't do that, but uh, you get the idea. But that's my guy. So uh, back to focus here. Juan Soto. We got Edward Oliveras rookie card. Yeah, Juan Soto's cool. Is that Harvey Kuhn? You know the old school guys better than I do. Keen? Keen, Kuhn, something. Uh, George Mateo or Jorge Mateo, probably. You got Shoeless Joe. Oh, really? Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Who's, oh, is that the. Oh, no, I, I no. It, the... This is a uh, Nick Madrigal oh, rookie oh, card. Nice. Yeah, Chicago. Mm -hmm. it's so, okay. You're getting buzzed. You get buzzed. What's Luis that? Gonzalez rookie card, AP. The satchel, that's a cool satchel page. Another satch? Yeah. You see that? It's a good one. Oh, it's the same one. Ted Williams. Yeah, I've got like a five second memory. Ted Williams, Daz Cameron rookie card. That's pretty cool. You got a Dane Dunning rookie card. You got a Christian Posh. We'll just say Posh A because I don't know. It's the rookie card. And a Bobby Dahlbeck, Diamond King, and Sandy Colfax. I feel like I'm seeing a lot of the same names, but. Uh, yeah, I wonder how big this is. Different ones. Probably not terribly big. I was going to say, did we just collect it all in like four boxes? Probably not, but. Um, after this, I think probably do, uh, after you finish. Yeah, if you want the people to vote, tell them, ask, tell them what they want to see. Because if there's people short Bowman's on time. Bowman's got to last, though. That's, that's well, everybody's, you know. You're that's what everybody's calling it on that. But I don't care what I rip. I'm actually just enjoying that. And it made my day that I got to see a Tony Gwynn card from... 20 years after I purchased a Tony Wynn card. So. Tony. It's good the, stuff. Where's the poor Kirby Puckett, huh? He's not the star anywhere else other than your made up hopes and dreams of Minnesota. I have a visitor. I don't. Jose Garcia rookie card. We got a Buster Posey. Must got a Posey Clark Schmidt, is he? Yeah. Isn't he like didn't he break his leg a couple years ago well, or something crazy? Ago. But oh, yeah, he uh rookie card. Know, that dude is Teddy Ball game. Could you imagine if like uh, you know, Joe Rhino, Mauer was as, as uh durable as you hate Joe Mauer more than I do. It's true. I don't I don't like Joe like, Mauer. Like it's even hard to have a conversation with you on that. What do we got? Sixto Sanchez rookie. That's kind of a cool card. I didn't Sixto. Honus Wagner, but not the Honus Wagner no. that you'd want. Dang, I thought you were going to pull it from the Yeah, I know, from a thousand years <laughs> later. I'm wondering even how it was. Shirt and Apostle. Rookie card there. <laughs> Joe Morgan. Does he still do you know baseball games? So there's a Vladdy Jr. This oh, that's cool. Dalton Jeffries die cut thing, uh, rookie card. It's always cool when you get the Honus Wagner. That, like special rookies. That's a cool Johnny Bench card. Legacy left old graphs. Jose Abreu. He was a big shining star when they got him, right? Jacob DeGrom. Is he the dude that yeah. literally tears it up but has like four wins a year? now, but dude is... Francisco Lindor. Insane. Having statistically least, like one of the yeah. best years by a pitcher ever. But he never gets wins because of who he plays for, right? Yeah. Dalton Jeffries. His ERA is like 1.09. And Evan White. So we got, looks like, one box left of these. And then we'll move on. People have preferences for what they'd say. I think you do one of that, that black, the black uh, the collectors baseball ones collectors. <laughs> what are those? Um, okay, so there's like a pack or two packs in there. And then 
they throw some random cards in there. So like, I bought a bunch of them. Are they cool at least? Yeah, well, they're especially cool if you're like an old school fan because you know, like, oh, these all these old players. Well, that's what we're dealing with here, but you're not going to roll with. Yeah, but these are like these old players are the greatest. Look at who's right on the top there. there. <laughs> Tony Gwynn, people. Tony G. I feel like you should have every time I pull a Tony Gwynn card, like some sound effects that clap or cheer. <laughs> Where's the, just just pocket? for me. You, he's, Kirby Puckett's not even your guy. It's Kent Herbeck, and they probably stopped it's producing true, exactly. Herbeck cards 4,000 years ago. No, they're still making them, and some of them are super expensive. Really? It's Herbeck? Yes. Okay, well, we'll move on with these, because I don't care about Herbeck. <laughs> Tony Gwynn. It's crazy. Juan Soto. Edward Olivares. Harvey, you said Keen. Keen. We'll go with Keen. We got Jorge Mateo, rookie card. You got Shoeless Joe. I don't like when they like, make me flip these. Like, can't you guys at the factory figure this out before you send them we'll out? Put them all in Casey the Mize, rookie card. I feel like there's been a thousand Casey Mizes. What do we got? Ha Sung Kim, rookie card. Never heard cool. of him. We got a Adonis Medina, rookie. We got a Carl Erskine. Hey, Brooklyn Dodgers. Erskine, uh, I think he died recently, but I used to... Like you could, you wrote him, didn't you? A bunch of times, and he, you would have Luis his card back within less than a week. That's crazy cool. He was awesome. So what we got here one of those die cut things of Dylan Carlson. Not pulling another we old county. Edward Alavares. Well, we got more packs to go. That's a cool <laughs> David Ortiz card. Oh, got David Ortiz in there. That's cool. That was when cool. he was good, not as a twin. Uh, yeah, that's a show. Hey, you called it. There it is. That's a cool card, too. You got an Otani there? Oh, an ours proof Otani. Nice. That's awesome. So we got the Angels. We can only hope better for you. Al Kaline. Wasn't he a twin? No. Or just a tiger? That's right, yeah. Uh, maybe I just hear his name enough. Christian run, Pache. He, he was a guy that used to that would sign everything. Like, Al Kaline autographs are everywhere. There's a couple of those Hall of Famers that just... You know, signed everything. Dylan Carlson. So, yeah, there's another old Shohei in there. That's I, I, have we seen a trout yet? I don't feel like no, we have. No, we haven't seen a trout yet. Okay, so Green wants to go with these crazy things. Yeah, let's open that. They're, 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 they're actually heavy. So whatever's in there, maybe there's just a weight. Okay, that's, yeah, what, what you got? Eight pounds of glue holding it down. That is the part that the pain to get out. So, so if I get my hacks, so I'm... I be careful. Well, I didn't put the safe on there. Oh, did you see that Luis Gonzalo is a? Oh, dang! Is it numbered? I didn't look for those. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna be as it's careful. A one, as it's I a can. one of one. Sweet. What is that? A, I think that's what San that Diego is. Padre. You see it? Whose kid is that? Luis Gonzalez. Oh yeah. It's but, like you showing the camera. So something. Uh, yeah, it says one on one. I, I think. can't really get a good look at this. You see it. I'm going to just pull it back. Yeah, it is a one of one, which is like really small, cursive, and I've never seen a numbered card do that. So just above my thumb there is that. So you probably need to load that up and get it away from me. Yeah, that's, that's cool that you have. Oh, there's the little, uh, whatever that little thing is right there. I can't okay, what you guys aren't seeing is there's, there's eight pounds of glue on here, and I'm not really exaggerating. So at the expense of not completely destroying, can we go through the bottom? I don't know if there's a great way. I don't know if I'm making it worse by kind of trying to baby it out. I, I, I really don't know if there's a great way you to You know what? It. Can we do this? Yeah, just like just be as careful as possible. Well, outside they are of... pain. I you know, to open those stupid things. Because they sell them at Walgreens and Well, uh, there you go. They've answered plenty. If you would have said Walmart, these boxes would have just ripped open by looking at them. Right, so Walgreens is trying to save stuff from being stolen, I guess. All right, so that's what's in there. And there's another thing to pull back here. You know, we don't, we don't care about this. We don't care about that. There's a pack that looks like it's from 1984. 
trying to get it all to come down here. What are these, like 1980s cards? What do we got going on here? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's just a bunch of random cards. They throw these in, and right. then a random pack. Random pack. Yeah, that's what that seriously like. looks like something I would have opened in 1991. It is. That's like 88 or 80. So this is a wax pack from that far? Are you kidding me? Yeah. Cheap bastards. So I'm going to do half of these. Yeah, there's an 87 Bruce Ruffin. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm not going to. I'll go gift. through the names, but geez, Jerry Willard. Didn't even know that, and I probably had most of these I cars. Mean, yeah, you could probably just go quick through those. Bruce Hurst. They got a Julio Franco, a Pat Burrell. Wasn't he a twin at one point? No. no. Javier Vasquez, too good for the twins. Emilio Bonifacio, Carlos Gomez, Derek Lowe, oh, go, go. Jesus him. Flores, Brandon Belt, J.D. Martinez, Mike Matuk, Andrew Chafin, Doug Drabeck, oh, for God's sakes, <laughs> Al Leiter. Uh, if anybody wants the Greg Briley card, I mean, maybe he purchased uh, one at auction. Greg, if you're out there listening, kudos. Willie Frazier, Tam Can Candiotti. Wasn't he a knuckleballer? Yeah, the candy man. <laughs> well, these are the worst cards ever. Like, fuck. Sorry, I uh, didn't mean to do that. Uh, Jeff Zimmerman, <laughs> Andre Scalaraga. What even is that? I don't even know what. what? Tops, tops what? To tops, tops total? total? Tops total. Total of what? Total of guys that didn't make the league? I have no clue. Uh, no, the cards are in these are just odd. Josh, Jesse Barfield. I feel like there's a Josh that played for Toronto some years later, but I could be making that up. Steve Bouchel, Dan Wilson. Hey, checklist. Where did checklist? the checklist Yay. go? Scott Jaster. Of Dan the Wilson, Birmingham. that's a former gopher. Yeah, well, great. Jeff Reed. Minor league cards? Sweet. Dave Reed. I don't. I'm having some PTSD looking at these old Donruss and Tops cards. Like, oh my god, this Keith Hernandez card came like this coming up here, Steve Lyons. But look at how awful that card is. Somebody put this in their bike spokes. Like, this is. I'm just gonna say it's not gonna be a gem in ten. Uh, why would they do that, Johnny Coito? Well. Nobody bought into this for those packs, you know. Well, <laughs> I wonder why. You could have tried to trick some third graders and made a <laughs> fleece them. Russell Martin, well, you got a franchise like history. Cool. Yeah, I'm sure it's worth eight cents. <laughs> Rod even, Barra. I'm that's just going cool. through these. I'll point out if there's a star because, yeah, quite frankly, it's a those. little more depressing to tell you who they are. David Wright? Yeah. No. Russell Branion. David Wright's kind of David cool. Freeze. I know he was a like Johnny Damon played for the Tigers. Bill Hughes. Yeah, it was like at the end of his career. I'll go. I'm not even. Yeah, don't know if those, anybody's worth sleeving. I that. actually think that uh, Keith Hernandez. The Keith was. Hernandez is. Lou Witta. Sweet Lou. Lou Whittaker. DJ Dozier. Ah, <laughs> that's funny. DJ Dozier. Uh, Roland. Rolando Arroyo, this Ricky Botanical, wasn't he a twin? Remember these crazy Metal Universe cards? Metal Universe cards? Oh, oh my God. God, that's crazy. J Bell, Steve Sachs, Sam Horn, Cole Calhoun, Louis Polonia, Sweet Lou again. Yeah, great, great. But apparently, every Lou Whitaker card is coming in this stack. Um, Brian Giles. Phil Hughes. He was a twin, Phil Hughes was. So literally, I lost out on that. That's a cool Jermaine Die card. Well, I mean, he's not probably right? worth anything, but like he was a cool player. I like Jermaine. Kevin Dye. Apier. Kevin Apier. <laughs> he's a tops Gold Cup rookie. There's Tom. Oh, I'll, I'll sleeve and put that in a hard card case. Can't say he'll be happy about that. Oh, look at that! We hit another checklist here. So Franklin Stubbs. Franklin Stubbs. Andy Van Slyke. Didn't they call him the Great White Hope? Dave Justice. The best thing about him was Halle Berry. Here's Greg Bad. Oh, uh, no, sorry. Greg McMichael. Got some. Nah. Good <laughs> so, Ruben Sierra. <laughs> Another checklist. Okay, there's Ken Griffey Sr. <laughs> Tony said, he said, I think I have all those cards in my vintage box. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you should name it vintage, though. Kelly Down. God, these are awful. The fact that you made me open them set me back. I'm, I'm, I'm excited for you to open that pack, years. though. 
the pack. That's yeah. going to be worse than these. Is there gum? I'd, I'd chew the gum if people want to throw in an extra Sweet. couple bucks. There's pegs. Holly Rubo? Yeah. There's a San Diego. Yeah. For all these looking at, they're not, hey, look, there's that Bruce Ruffin that every kid in the 80s had. <laughs> every kid in the 80s. Glad you opened all those. I'll sleep them all. Let's so is this the tops. one with the puzzle piece? Do you get a puzzle piece yeah. with these? Oh, these are leaf even. Oh, so they're leaf? God, they couldn't even give you like Oh, something. you get three puzzle pieces. If you feel like if you get enough, we might be able to put the puzzle together. That might be worth something. God, even just touching these wax packs is... I almost feel like the cops are going to bust in like we're trying to pick up somebody on the down and down. I don't know whose face that I think was that uh, Stan? Stan Musial, yeah. Oh, look right on top. That's 88. So it's, well, it's down. Rest yeah, it's, I thought it was Leaf. I'm sorry. Devin White. Danny Tarnbull. That's... Yeah, great. We're not reading names because we don't care. Gene Larkin. For all of you Twins fans, I am <laughs> not. He has a, is he, isn't he the dude that hit the ball? 91 clinch? World Series. Yeah. yeah. Won the game. There's Winfield as a Yank. Winfield as a Yank. Yeah, Tom cool. Glavin. Boy, does he look Glavin? young that's, there. That's a Glavin rookie. Is it? Well, here you go. Bob James, Dave Bergman, Ryan Sandberg, Danny Tartable is the Diamond King. And then Rene Gonzalez. Yeah, I mean, the, that, getting that Glavin's kind of cool. Yeah, that's a cool really card. Nice shape. I mean, the, these cards are hard to get in good shape. Oh, I getting, the, getting the Tommy Glavin out of that garbage. <laughs> $3 card, if that. I know, but if you sent it. I mean, it's... Ugh. Ray Winfield's cool. God, these are oh, boxes. Oh, Ryan Sandberg. I didn't hear you say that. I didn't. Because... Why do you hate Ryan Sandberg? Because he hates me. True. Oh, a whole other mess of those. Well, I wonder what the uh, the pack is. Another it looks like the same, to be honest. I, I promise I will oh, never add year. those to a, uh, a thing again. Yeah, I feel like that. these alone are probably just destroying your reputation. I know, right? They it were found like... on an episode of Storage Wars. <laughs> Did Brandy and Jared get them? Or was it Dave Hester? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, I think we are got cards stuck on the glue down there. That's so stupid. I, sorry, guys. This is going to have to. That's not my fault. You can see right on that corner that buzz because there was glue glue down there. Yeah. That's Genius. So because people. Uh, those, are, are, those are Fairfield, though. They're repacks. So obviously. Well, repacks. If you got them from wherever, like. They clearly, nobody was going into Walgreens to steal baseball cards. Anibal Sanchez. Desmond Jennings, that's a rookie card. I don't know anything about Desmond Jennings, but if you want to load him up. That's a, no, that's the second year. He's got a gold cup right, on there. Right, the gold cups are always the second year. Oh, They're really? Like the top's rookies of the year type things. Jeez, now we're getting guys I've never even heard of. You could probably skip. I mean, unless oh, look somebody at that. really has a, a roof. Fino Linares, <laughs> he roofied people. Jose Canseco, weren't these Opeachy Premieres supposed to be the bomb cards? Yeah, back in the they day? were expensive, dude. Like they were uh, like a buck or a buck fifty a pack. Chipper Jones, rook. Is a rookie? That's what it says. Huh? We'll see. Oh, look at though. It's kind of well. Yeah, the card itself is not in the best shape, but That's you saw good. the box they pulled it out from. So yeah, I'll put it there. There's a Cano. Is it a no? It's Seattle on there, so it's definitely not. There's yeah. a Doc Gooden. I put the the chipper in the. Jeez, these cards are just an awful. Doug Drayback was an Oster. I mean, for Pittsburgh, he was good. That was that. <laughs> they uh, that the year ninety one. The, when the Braves are beating them out. Yeah, this is where all these cards stuck. Look at that. They're even good. Just dangle them. No. Nope. Raphael Ramirez? I mean him. Bill Kruger. We probably want to like, take Runger. those out so they yeah. don't touch the other cards. Yeah, I'll just stick them over there. Alan Wiggins. I feel like that was Candace Wiggins' dad. That was a former female basketball player for Stanford. Oh, I'm yeah, sure nobody. But I'm going to give you a lot of information that you're not signing up for. Um, yeah. I think these cards should we'll just be those, burned. Keep those uh, those glue ones away from Saberhagen. I don't want to send them to people and like 
Is it Saber Hagen? Yeah, I like Saber Hagen. That dude was a trooper, except he took a World Series away from my Cardinals back in 85. Right. My twins did that, too. Andy Allenson. Wasn't he a guy that played for the twins at one point? Mm, this Chamberlain. The entertainment value of these two boxes, Tony, was not priceless for us that are here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you didn't even call out the Kevin Moss. Oh, oh Kevin yeah, because I, did, I didn't even really see him. I love Kevin Moss. There, there's a John Crookie. He was not. Is a Crook rookie? Just no, a it's just a Crookie. Probably, oh, yeah. yeah. That's cool. That card, but... team that should have been softball stars. Oh, another metal card? Yeah, it was... Uh, that was What's the Diamond King? Say Ricky in Alaska, but it's not. It's Metallico. There's a new card in there. What's that? Yeah, that's a, a Dubal Herrera. That's I don't know cool. anything about him. Ron Kittle. Shane Victorino. Ron Kittle. Shane Victorino? I like yeah. him. The Flying Danny Hawaiian. Carl <laughs> Mike Twadarski. These are some. Uh, my early, those are my early cards. Russ yeah. Springer, he was a Yankee, I think. Well, yeah, we're going to need to invest in a better camera, I think. Or better cards. To make... God, these cards are just... Hey, look at that. Look at the quality on this card. This and is a tops. PSA negative five. <laughs> Greg Brock. Huh? Bill Wegman. We're all very excited about these. <laughs> They're so bad. I just am kind of flipping through them, but hoping like... Maybe the world will surprise me with That's something. This Cardinals there. World Series card. That's kind of cool. Well, yeah. Well, hey, you feel better now? No. <laughs> well, who's the triple? Because we have to. We have to actually have a, a thing. This here. Yeah. Who are the players on it? Uh, you got uh, Jose Reyes, Brian Braun, and Sean Kemp. That's no, not Sean Kemp. Who's the? Uh, Sean Kemp. Oh, he's. I think. When I thought of Sean Kemp, I thought of the Gary Payton throwing an alley oop. I gotta find my app. We have to do a uh... Juan Rivera. It's, guys, I just didn't go through these because they're actually kind of terrible. When you get your cards and you find them in there, if you get somebody great, I'm happy for you. But I'm gonna go with the notion that you're probably not going to. So we have uh, these this pack again. Let's see what part of uh, Stan the Man we're getting this time. Maybe we'll get his feet. Nope. Just something that's starting all star. A John Farrell, rated rookie. Sean Abner. Hey, that uh, that triple card? Where is yeah. It? We have to do a... Uh, because it's just written into the okay. the, the actual uh, There's a auction. Ray Gagne twin card. Stunk. A who? Oh, there's a Gagne. Frankie B? No. Where? No. Here's the here's the app. Wade Boggs. Oh, Boggs and Gus Poller. Yeah, these cards are just awful. So put three fingers down. Whoever gets the Okay. It's the Dodgers. That Dodgers is. are getting this quality. Like I'm gonna slide it off to pick it up. Okay. I'll make sure it goes to a Dodger. Right here. Get, get All right, on. can I actually like open packs Something now that are good. real? Right? Yeah, go for it. That was painful. That was extremely painful. Uh, what do you guys want next? We'll just go with these over here. The, the tops. Yeah, open something fun after dealing with that. Dude, I could open poop and it would have been more fun. <laughs> Those were. Yeah, that was poop, so. I mean, seriously, somebody made money by keeping all the cards they found at the dump. And putting them in a box with eight gallons of glue on the top. And finding somebody at Walgreens, you said you got these? Yeah. yeah. Finding somebody there that didn't care enough about their clientele. They're all, that's that Fairfield. Fairfield does really I don't packs. care. I don't like Fairfield anymore. I'm not sure who they were before, but I definitely don't like them now. Yeah. I won't buy those ever again. You've just made at least some of the live people here happy. Or, or pissed. <laughs> You're sending me all this crap? I don't really like how they do these boxes now. So I'm going to open half. Put those there. All right. Here we go. Go on to some good stuff. Can't see these names too well. Mark 
God. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to be able to read these names. I'll stop if they look like there's somebody good, but it's pretty small print. You need your readers, old man? No, oh, I need it to actually be written and not have a camera in my face. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like Tony's comments anymore. They were fun for a while, but now he's just getting too personal. <laughs> Max Kepler. <laughs> Tony, we watched the whole train wreck. So, uh, side note, uh, Kepler, I was live. You know how much I love baseball and the Twins to boot, but I saw his first career home run against the Red Sox. Ah, I like Kepler. Tony Coito, Clayton Kershaw. Kershaw. Max yeah. Muncie. I've actually heard of him. A Detroit Tigers card here. We got Josh Harrison. Jose Urena. Ian Anderson. I'll bring them closer if there's somebody good, which I probably flipped through eight of them that are good. But these cards don't strike me as great either. Elbows only. It's Justin Upton. Okay. Gaussman, Max Scherzer. Uh, Scherzer's got the craziest eyes. Yeah, he was born that way, so leave him alone. Jacob DeGrom. DeGrom. Jock Peterson. Jacob DeGrom again. We'll set that the, there. Yeah. Flip him. We've got some stuff going on here. Edward Olivares rookie card. There's the foil of Freddie Galvis. And then a Jordan Alvarez. So we'll put those there. And go with these. Buster Posey, Joey Bar. These cards are way cooler. Nate Pearson, Mike Piazza. This is the look at this. There's a 1986 tops like kind of Oh like, yeah, yeah. They do that. That's kind of cool. They got a Die cut card of Willie McCovey. Oh, really? Yeah. That's kind of cool. It's a very cool card. You guys check that out. Albert Abreu, Tarek Scubble, Jake Bowers, Charlie Blackman, Eloy Jimenez. Oh, so that Jacob DeGrom, there's two in a row. One was a league leaders card and one's a. Just a Jake DeGrom regular Chris cards. Davis. That guy's still in the league. Freddie he Freeman. Like just retired. Raphael Devers. The league leaders of Marcel Ozuna. Sonny Gray. Sonny Gray seems like he's been in the league for a thousand years, guys too. Sleeve him up. Some White Sox. We got that. That. Teddy yeah, Edward. Great. Oliveris, the rookie card. These card. cards, guys, are not By the way, that was numbered. Special. The Edward uh, Oliveris is seventeen ninety five of twenty twenty one. All right, my bad. That's cool. That's cool. Here's a future stars of Jesus. So, board him up. Byron Buxton was supposed to be good, but really he, isn't. He is, but he isn't. No, you got to be able to play to be good. God, he's. I'm expecting a big Matt old Chapman, contract. And Joaquin Soria is still around. Joaquin Soria. I like him. There's uh, Randy Dobnik, Minnesota. Dobnik. Who the hell is he? <laughs> the Uber driver. Just, really? Yeah, he was an Uber driver. Guy was an Uber, and then they talked him off the the side of the road and said, hey, come pitch for the Twins. I've, uh, I've yeah. driven Uber, and I have never gotten that kind of offer for any squad. Yeah, I mean, I feel like you have to throw faster than 40. You're assuming I can get to 40? <laughs> My... Well, there's all the rookies, huh? Yeah, I just kind of... If there's, like, crazy cards in there, it's like I think they need to do a better job at, like, telling me that they're good cards. <laughs> they just have, like, an announcer. Hey, by the way... Well, I feel like there should be something more than it looks like everything else. Minus, we'll just throw a number on there. I mean, just look for that, especially for the rookie card symbol. I think you're going to make somebody's day with these two of nine stand musical puzzle pieces from earlier. Oh, uh, I suppose uh, ship those out to the Cardinals. <laughs> we'll do those on there. Jesus Sanchez, that's a rookie card. That's cool. So I'll just drop him there. Patrick Corbin, Tony Kemp, Jay Bruce. I hate when they flip him. Eric Sodgard. God, Jay Bruce. Malik oh, Smith, Brandon Crawford, Chris Paddock. No idea. Steven Motts, Mark Kana. We'll just go with that. Willie, somebody. 
We got some cheering San Diego guys here. Oh, San Diego team too. Trevor Williams. We want another big hit. Come on. We're pulling. Well, these might be as bad as the cards we just opened. Tops has always been kind of weird, though, about like their hits. If you get one, it's usually good. Or at least that's how it was 8,000 years ago when I collected it. Pujols. Remember back in 91 when the, the hits were... Uh, uh, Cards like old cards from the past, right? And actually, they would insert randomly. Like, I pulled like a 68 Yankees team, so I do a little, yeah. the team card. These cards are just, uh, they might even be worse than the 87 ones. The league leader, Juan Soto, oh, look at that! Somebody's got this thing. Oh, redemption. It's a promotion. Oh, it's card. a home run derby. Who's the player? Register for the challenge. And Eugenio Suarez. Suarez for the Reds. Yeah. yeah. So they what they do is they scratch it and they go online and pick a day when they think he's going to hit a home run. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah. That's cool. It's got to be random. I don't know who that guy is. I have the, uh, uh, what's his hey, name? Hey, look at that. The Donaldson. There's a Shohei card here. I mean, it's not a hit, but cool card. Shohei's a. Definitely out uh, making appearances today. A Miguel Cabrera card. We got a Jordan Alvarez. Got a Buster Posey. Got that Ricky Henderson lovely card. A Ricky Henderson? <laughs> yeah, the old 86 tops. Oh, the 86 one. tops looking. That's Mike cool. Mike Piazza. I saw the, the, the Piazza 86. That was funny. Pedro Severino. Max Fried. Reed, Edward Oliveris, Jose Abreu, something Garcia, Leroy maybe, Eldorado. That that Raul Mondesi's kid is it? Yeah. A serious? Yeah. He's yeah. got a kid that plays too. Everybody's got kids. So if play. you played like the eighties, nineties, apparently your kid, if, assuming he was male, made it to the big leagues. <laughs> Tarek Scubble, Charlie Blackman, Jake Bowers. Nomar Mazzara, Austin Hayes, Robbie Ray. Oh, God, those Blue Jays jerseys are awful. When uh, when are we going to see another fans. boon? No, oh, like those five generations or some yeah, crazy. Yeah. I haven't seen like Aaron, like any of those last ones were Aaron and Brett. When are we, we going to see another Aaron? Clevenger, Nelson Cruz, Kristen Yelich, Chris Taylor. The Motor City Mashers. Howie Kendrick. Byron Buxton. Could be good. Just could. isn't. Buster Posey. Gotta stay healthy. Yeah. I just bitter it because I had to hear for years, oh, wait until the twins' kids come. And then they showed up and they can't even stay on the damn field. Match happen. Sorry, dude. These are not the best cards either like i there's no art to them there's just like that's always base. it looks like me taking a picture with my kodak what do they call those instant cameras back that in the piazza day that's a sweet yeah well, it's still piazza what do they call those polaroids that's what these cards look like to me you know wasp is watching this and is he he's taking all the He's taking half these pictures, so. But I don't think he works for Tops. I, I thought, thought he, he was an upper too. deck guy. I don't. Know. Uh, I think he uh, wasn't. Th yeah, I, I don't think he's like a. I don't want to say free agent. Somebody's asking what's a Kodak. <laughs> it was a name brand for cameras. <laughs> and Tony, I felt like you were our age. Yeah, he's older. He's older. Old guys asking whether he's probably Kodak. got one then. Don't talk about my Kodaks. Yeah, he tapes it onto his like his old flip phone and says, "Look, I got a camera phone." Flip phone? Does you still play Snake? <laughs> Snake. Let's do this. I don't want to flip that up. So yeah, Oscar Mercado, Brandon Nemo. Brandon Nemo. Here's a rookie card of Nate. Pearson, we'll give you that one. There's a Vladdy Jr. Vladdy Jr., nice. Jesus Aguilar. I love baseball. At any point, you could have picked it up and 
there'd be a Jesus <laughs> or an Ivan de Jesus. Jorge. Hey, look, there's a Jake Adrazi. Is uh, uh, Jake Odorazzi. Who's the guy that you tweeted when your Denard Span got traded? You no, it wasn't freaking... Denard Span. It was. Uh... It was an outfielder, though. Yeah. Um, crap. That's Harper, and, by the way. And he, uh, he kind of was snotty. Back. Yeah, because he doesn't need sh any shenanigans from some <laughs> from some punk. Talking Humberto Mayha. Mayhew. Mayhew is it? It doesn't have a you or I water. It's upstairs. Mayhew? I don't like I see Nick somebody. Nick Senzel. I need more sleeves. Dylan Bundy. Oh, there's more over there. Washington, Chicago. Looks like Toronto. Glad he's in there. He's trying to download his picks from his Kodak right now. <laughs> yeah, tell me how that works out. <laughs> Maybe if you turn Napster off, you'll get to him. <laughs> Napster. <laughs> There's a rookie card at the bottom there. Some Pearson guy. Hey Tony, how is the uh how's the sound by the way? And Pujols. Roberto, Blake Taylor. This like I said, these are very tough to read with this camera. Kind of in my face. So getting a lot of like Team cards. That's a raise one. Is that uh, Brewers? Paul De Hong jersey card. We got. It's numbered one twelve nice. to one ninety nine. I don't know who this guy is, but that's the card. It looks actually kind of cool, given the nineteen eighty six tops retro. Tops retro. But they might as well just do all of them. So there you go for that. That's a pretty yeah, cool the, card. Oh, that is a sweet card. MySpace. He's going to look us up on MySpace. Now, you're probably some Russian blonde, aren't you? Trying to get money because somebody abducted you, aren't you? Uh, Strasburg, Alex Baum, Dylan Carlton, Paul Goldschmidt. There's your guy. There's your guy. There he is. There he is. Hey, Jeff Donaldson. Nice. There's a cool card here. What's after it? Uh, it's the History of Tops. First playing cards are sold. I don't know what is this is. Is it a card is. or is a, it, if it's a card, we have to do a thing? It's definitely a card. I don't know who it's, what Can it is. Leave There's, it up. We'll do a. Here, I'm just going to put this up here right now so you guys yeah, can not, not see it anymore. According to the eBay rules, I have to, I have to do a thing for it ebay rules they actually have specific rules to this stuff no but if i post it like if i set the rules i have to follow the rules obviously well clearly but, but i just thought like ebay is not innovative enough to do all there's that. three teams on there so somebody yeah. could be like hey like that's a you didn't it's a, i like the look of the card it's probably some sort of promo card yeah, that's worth nothing, nothing. Big, I think. trying to look they don't seem like they give this guy i've seen his Goofy hair a couple times now. Mike Clevinger, or probably Clevenger, but you get the idea of how much you don't like him. Byron Buxton, great. It's exciting. Adam Brazier, yeah. Charlie Moore. If that dude could stay healthy, he would be. A yeah, I'll be 85 years old by then. He'll Who? Make, he won't make it. Randy Dobnik. Dobnik. They stink. Pitch the game and then take you home on the Uber. Hey, you can make good bank doing it over. <laughs> I mean, you're never going to be a guy that picks. Oh, he just says games. he's part Russian. He is hitting us up on MySpace later. I'm going to be next to it. Don't run out of internet with your AOL 500 yeah. free minutes discs. <laughs> These are just the last two packs of uh, those tops cards. They're not obviously in those other boxes, just a two pack thing. I'm getting kind of tired of seeing twins, largely because I know they're not very good. There's not going to be a, any hit of a twin. Let's see. I'll flip them this way. There's a Pavel foil down there somewhere. AJ Pollock. Somebody there. Mitch White. That's a cool card. Uh, Future Stars for San Diego. Trent Grisham. I guess it's not the guy from uh, yeah, 
or some of the guy that used to do, I can't remember, it's, uh, CSI maybe. <laughs> just throwing all these, we should just throw all references in for Tony, Mitch Moreland, Mike Trout. See, these cards are just nothing special to me. But there's a something coming up. I don't know what it'll be. It's always going to be that one. Wasn't like, Shane Bieber like supposed to be a good he is player? Good, yeah. Okay. So they know. Dial up connection. I wish that you had that sound too. We could play it right now. <laughs> you need to up your game with some of these sound effects. Archie Bradley. That's that's the, a hollow foil. I'll take the I'll take the hollow right here. I don't here. know who Archibald is, but Yadier Molina. That guy's finally retiring, right? I, I don't know, dude. I, I think he's got to be a Hall of Famer just because of his defense. Yadier Molina again. You got yeah. That's not numbered. That's too bad. Aaron Judge. And Marwin Gonzalez, another twin that... See, we get guys like Marwin Gonzalez, like the 26th guys of the Astros roster because the dudes are too cheap. And people are the future stars. That's good. Trout. Trout. Yachty. Yachty. Not going to be too upset to get rid of these cards. Maybe I'll open those, that one. Let's see who next. next. Already looking forward. Trevor Williams, Hunter Renfro, Griffin Channing. Is it Channing? Canning. <laughs> yeah, Miami. They're, they are hard to read, dude. Like, you would have some difficulty, and then you'd feel a little bit terrible for giving me crap. Christian Posh, I rookie card. That. I'll just give that to you. Miggy Cabrera, I do too. You're not a very nice person. Yeah, Gio Gonzalez, Gio. thought he was good at one point. He was good. For a, this is maybe the best card we pulled in all sarcasmness. Mark McGuire. Um, Didn't even know you could get dudes like that. Aaron Judge. That's what sixty eight or sixty nine. What's that? Tops. Like that's a sixty or sixty. All of these. No, that, that McGuire. I think it's 68 tops. Is oh. what they kind of like, you know, 86 yeah. tops. It's like, I think it's 68. Bryce Harper card. Wrong, Somebody Kirby can correct me. Yates. Me. Archie Pete Bradley. Pete Alonzo. Pete Alonzo. Pistol Pete. Right here. Right, we'll get these out of the way. Going to the blue. Yeah, we'll just do that because there's one in there. Are these, is there anything good in here? What can we uh, tell the viewers on this pack? Uh, no, I mean, that here? one, you, is, oh, that thing, that, I mean, I don't know what the pack is in there. Is it, it's the, it's oh, another one of those, loose cards? It's, it's, it's probably, uh, it's just like the other, okay. kind of like the bigger. Yeah, so I'm the, starting the to see some loose cards. Cool. What's the pack? I don't well, know. look at that. They glued the card. This is what we're dealing with. The Fairfield? Oh, they did. Well, what is it? Oh, that tells you something right there. The Fairfield Company. See that logo? Look eerily similar. Tony, or are you still using the chat rooms from AOL? Oh, that card's glued. I would love if that card was like a sign card or something. Good Lord. If you ever see these, I think they should pay you to just dump them. I'm kind of curious to see what's in the pack. I think it's a cool pack. Right? It might be, but look at that. Kids at home. If David Freese is your guy, this is <laughs> not for you. Oh, what's that card under it, though? It's a Diamond King. Yeah, I would say, not sure. It's Matt Kemp. Matt Kemp? It's kind of cool. I thought you said his name was Sean Kemp. Well, Sean not Kemp is playing basketball. Well, I asked you that earlier. Go back Matt and uh, view the <laughs> commentary the, later. Rewind the commentary. Oh, there's, uh, there's your favorite player of all time. <laughs> what? Oh, if I if if I didn't have to send it, I'd rip that card in half. <laughs> no, whoever got St. Louis may let you do that. Scott Wayfield, that's a cool card. Finally, something. They should, yeah, put gum in the packs. They did. Scotty Layfield. For all you feel, another Tom Her. You you gotta ask Green why he loves Tom Her so much, Matt wow. Noakes. Man, I hate Tommy Her. Oh, dude, there's gum in this. What is pack. that thing? What is that weird card? This is a minor league card of 
Uh, what what kind is it? Star? Star? There, you remember Star Card? The Tom yeah, Pratt. That's crazy because the Star Cards were like the basketball ones. So the, the bet is uh, like, if we can get a GoFundMe cool. for the death that I'll experience if I chewed the gum in here. That is 88 tops, dude. Some of the worst cards ever created. You gotta you gotta eat that gum. I think that's, you think, I think it'll even be pink anywhere? Yeah, yeah. I watch this other guy who opens all the time, like classic facts. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, the, the 2013 that? Pinnacle. That's kind of cool. Yeah, we'll I open these saying, but... exhilarating tops cards. Yeah, do the tops. And first. I'm gonna like put the gum down. No, you said you're gonna eat it. Yeah. Well, it says they know the drugs right here. Uh, vote like you. You guys should say whether or not he has to eat it. But it says say no to drugs. I feel like I'm torn. To appease you. Oh, it's like he, Tony. Oh, do you think you should eat the gum? Look I get that. Eat the gum. Yeah, look it's pink. That. It looks good. The Try wrapper it. will taste better, is what he said. <laughs> Shall I bring it back for you, Tony? <laughs> there are some decent rookies, even though these cards are terrible. Oh, yeah, I feel I like you, I feel like you owe all these people an apology. <laughs> no I've never even heard of Daryl Ackerfelds, Gary Matthews, Dan Petrie, <laughs> Kevin Mitchell. Where's the uh, Greg, Greg Maddox is the one you want. Jay Baller. Kevin oh, Mitchell. Oh, there's your guy. There's your guy. There's your guy. Do you got, oh, you got TK? No, oh, you know what I, I'll tell you, like, my whole demeanor will change if he's actually good. Hey, Eddie good. Murray. I like him. Bud Bull, there you go. Man. There's a Ripken. There's Ripken. I'll put the Ripken in a there sleeve. You sleeve that up. Dave Smith and Andy McGaffigan. Yeah, the Ripken's kind of cool. Yeah. Grand. Wonderful. For all you guys still sticking with us, except for Tony, <laughs> uh, we appreciate it. I'm just here to try to make you laugh while I'm ripping some of the worst packs I've ever seen in my life. So hopefully in the ones to come we have something good and just continue to support Green Star's channel. Hit that subscribe button. And I don't know what else. There's another thing you do. Like, subscribe, like, share, subscribe. All, yeah, that, all that, that stuff. fun stuff. Look at that. Kel Ripken. These cards couldn't have been licensed. Look how like awful they are. They just stripped everything out. I didn't know Photoshop was a thing. The pinnacle back then. lose there. They must have lost their license for a while. There's a rookie card of Henry M. Rodriguez. So any Henry M. Okay, Rodriguez the fans Ripken, out there? The Ripken's kind of Jay cool. Chapman. Paul Canerco. Andy Pettit. You uh, Darvish. Orioles got to God, you, that has to be. Is that you Darvish? On. Is that his rookie? It, sure. It doesn't say it anywhere on there, but let's see. I'll put it in a case right away. Yeah. But it, actually yeah. Evan Longoria. Uh, what's it has one year on it, so this is probably a second year. Let's get those out of there. That's kind of cool, though. You sure you don't want this gum? <laughs> Tony said he wanted it. We'll make sure we uh next day air that to you so uh, it stays fresh. You Darvish is going to Texas to the Rangers. Cano is going so to we're the under Rangers. these guys, kids. These are kind of cool. I like them. Can I read the names? Yeah, because apparently they ran out of ink. Oh, the Chapman, or the Canerco is uh, artist proof. Is it? Yeah, that's kind of cool. An artist proof on a card they couldn't do anything with? Well, uh, there's a lot. I mean, after Top took over the, the license, they were able to other teams or other companies. I'm just curious. If you got a couple guys out there, I'm really dying to know the thoughts on uh, Fanatics taking over the card world. I'm personally not a huge fan of Fanatics, but let me know what you think. Uh, yeah, I'm curious to see what people think of that. Jameer Candelario, Ryan Yarbaugh, Brady Snyder, and Nick Heath. They, it looks like uh, some Royals 2021 stars. Oh, Brady Singer and Nick Heath. Rookie stars. That's a rookie. That's cool. Freddie Freeman. Fred Freeman. Jalen Beeks. Like Got some more rookie rookies for the Marlins. Sixto Sanchez and Jesus Sanchez. Any relation? <laughs> Brothers. You're supposed to know this. Is that Glybar Torres? I don't know how to pronounce his name. Jamie Barria. Or Barria, perhaps. Ryan Castellani. And Ashton Goudreau. 
Jerickson Profar. Jerickson Profar. Jesus Lazardo. That's uh, I can't read that. Boyhood. Okay, it looks like they took a picture of when. Oh no, that's Oscar. probably his. Like he probably played uh, in the uh, Little League World Series or whatever. Uh, Hunter Dozier. DJ Dozier's okay. son. Kiebert Ruiz and Mitch White of the Dodgers. Nice. Miguel Rojas. Whit Merrifield. I like these cards. They're cool looking. Victor Reyes. We got Joey Votto in action. The strikeout leaders. Okay, so yeah, there's three. three. It's uh, Jake DeGrom, Trevor We've Bauer, and Aaron We'll do those all at the end. We got Pudge Fisk, flashback. And Javier Baez in action. When I was a kid, I was mad that Pudge Rodriguez took Fisk's name. I don't care. <laughs> You're bitter. Pablo Lopez. Max Kepler in action. Cool. Miguel Castro. Tim Anderson in action. Although I don't see anybody moving. Miles Straw. Joey Bart in action. Bo Bichette. Oh, that's cool. Bo Bichette. Nathan Eovaldi. Abraham Toro. Like, <laughs> I don't know if I've seen a better baseball name than that. Nolan Arenado. Arenado. Antonio Senzatelia. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, guys. Miguel Andujar. Wait a minute. Wasn't there Joaquin Andujar? Is that his kid? The old pitcher for the Astros in the 80s? Uh, you know who I'm talking about. Yeah, I about. know who you're talking about. I, I mean, maybe, but I... Jake, we'll just call him Cave, because he's a twin, and he probably lives in one. <laughs> oh, That's where his skills were left. Justin Turner and Lance Thomas. Who's Jake Cave? Or is it Cave? Cave. This box two. Jake is Cave, yeah. One more of these and before we get to allegedly the good stuff. I say allegedly because Joe Bart, the Joey Bart school. We've come a long way here. That's cool. <laughs> get that out of the way. Open the spot. I would love to see an autograph. We haven't pulled one autograph today, have we? Oh, no, and we, I, that'd be awesome. We, I mean, we've had two. Give the fans what they want. Hits, but man, I'd love to see some. Here, I thought we were dealing with five hundred dollars a pack that you just got the absolute uh, Schneid top, on. Top's dynasty. Uh, uh, Is that what those were called? Yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't think that's the. Uh, God, I hate this plastic. It's so weird. I think they made it out of the recycled gum. We put these huge boxes in there. So did we get in? Nobody talking about this uh, fanatics taking over, and I'm not a fan of them. Actually, he's a big liar. Greg Soto, Adam Hazley, Jackie Bradley Jr. Jackie Bradley. Yeah. John what, John Lester still plays. Yep. Jacob Junis. Ronald Acuna, Martin Perez, CJ Crone. Wasn't he a twin? Ronald Acuna Jr. If he's all Wasn't awesome. CJ a twin at one point? CJ Crone, yeah. Paul Goldschmidt in action. Josh Stallmont. Jacob DeGrom in action. Jacob Stallings. Sixto Sanchez. I feel like I've seen Sixto enough to, hey, that's a rookie card. Do they do anything crazy for those? Nothing? Nope. Martin Maldonado, there's a Shohei. I think Martin Maldonado is uh, the son of Candy. Candy. Maybe. There's no time. Jason nice. Naylor, yeah. Naylor. There's a, I don't know, I guess. Josh Naylor? No, Blackman. Oh, Charlie John Blackman. Don't really know who he is. Drew Pomeranz. Why is this even a card? A 1972 flashback, the Golden Gate National Record. Yeah, whatever. Golden Gate. Just we'll just throw that area. in a baseball pack because we don't know what else to do with it. Taylor Williams. There's some Yankees guys. Uh, Albert Abreu, Miguel Yajari, Nick Nelson. I'm sure I got the middle guys name wrong. There's a Buki Betts, Austin Hayes. Why did the Red Sox trade Mookie? Could they not afford him? 
Honestly, I, I'm not sure. You got a Yerbalina, Ryan to Mount Castle. It's the Red Ryan Mount Castle. Afford, you know. Casey Mize, Tarek Ryan Scubo. Mount Castle. Yeah. Elroy Jimenez. I'm tired of seeing the, the, this particular guy. There's 20 some odd players on the roster, and we keep getting them. There's Jake a Mike Lederizzi. Trout. <laughs> got Trout. There you go. That's actually a pretty good pack you got. Mark Melancon. You got Trout, Otani. Tyler, is it this? Is it Naquin or Naquin? I, I feel like I've heard of him. World Series, the Rays. Is that through the that the Rays? Yeah. The, yeah, they, they win. win. Dylan Bundy. Dylan Bundy. Matt Barnes. And to wrap this pack up, we got an Aaron Judge. Yeah. That's actually a pretty solid pack. Lots of stars. No hits, but lots of stars. Well, at some point, we would like a hit. Yeah, dude. That's, we've had two hits so far. Two more, huh? And then, did you get any uh, interest on these basketballs? I haven't heard. Um, so, if anyone's interested in that in that, in that basketball we'll stuff. Throw it out here quick. That's the Downers basketball with uh, the Bell rookie. Or Bell, Ball rookie. Lonzo? Yeah. Well, what is it, Lonzo? The first one? Uh, who's going to get this? Golden Gate. Golden Gate, that's in San Fernando, right? So. No. It's in Egypt. Egypt. Okay, Egypt is getting. <laughs> yeah, so I guess, I guess we give it to the... Uh, we give it to the... Um, the Giants. Well, I mean... Seems somewhat logical if you ask. Seems about right. Okay, which nobody is. It's true. How many people are alive right now? How many people have nothing better to do than to listen to us? Us to be us. Ah, look at it. We're almost done. This and Bowman, like. I'm excited for the Bowman, man. Well, you better be, and your excitement better deliver. Uh, I mean, I'm not promising anything. If but I was going to say. I, two more hits. I feel like if there's not another hit, you should offer up a single pack to one of the lucky participants. <laughs> I can't have any more. Can't find any more baseball. Every time I go look and it's out. Well, you got to offer up your hopes. Spencer Turnbull, AJ, I'm going to call him AJ Puke because Is it, oh. it looks like <laughs> Shane Bieber. You were talking about uh, James Karshniak. Yeah, for some reason. Presents. Noah Syndergaard, if that guy could stay healthy, he'd be a beast. Dallas Keuchel. Tyler Mall. Trevor May. See, I told you there was another guy in the Twins. Juan Soto. They got some uh, 2021 stars. Jorge Mateo. And Edward Oliveris. Same team. Oh, we got to leave that one out. Leave that one out. Yep. There's a Fernando Tatis in action. Reese Hoskins. That's the first Tatis. Mookie Betts. Card I've seen. In action. Miguel Cabrera. Didn't know he still played. Will Smith. He does not look like the Fresh Prince to me. <laughs> Justin Upton still plays. Jeez. Willie Mays MVP trophy. Marco Gonzalez, Sixto Sanchez. Like, I really hope he's good. That's a rookie card, so we'll just leave that one oh. somewhere. Javier Baez. That's a cool looking rookie card, too. Uh, we got what? Tyro Estrada, Luis Robert Castillo. in action. Right here, we've got some Cardinal stars Cody Whitley and Raul Ramirez. Raul? A Rookie of the Year award for Jackie Robinson Award. That's kind of a cool card. Mm. Bo Bichette. So I guess Clint there's no Kershaw. team on that. We'll just get to Jackie Robinson. Bichette. Michael Chavis. Brandon Lowe. Shane Green. We got another rookie. Betts. Ali, Ali Sanchez and Franklin Colom. Jorge Soler. Michael Waka. Hmm. Got some American League stars. We got an Indian. It looks like Tristan McKenzie and Two Chris different. Bubik. Really bad side. Christian Yelich. Chris Taylor. 
All right. Now we're out of the bowling the pack. Ends. Ten packs. So plus two exclusive five card chrome packs. Chromes are hits, aren't they? Of sorts? Or am I making that up? Chrome's like better than base. Yeah, I don't think so. But not like probably knock it out of the park. Is Tony still watching? Or did he start watching Saved by the Bell? God, tell me that. I think it doesn't look like Drew. There's two of them out there. <laughs> God, right? So we've got our mega box. Doesn't feel that mega to me. I've never opened one of these, so I have no clue what to expect. Yeah, like that's the thing. Like there's just a pit. Take that out. All the little packs. Right down Were there. there. Eight packs in there? Yeah. Two, three. Seven packs? Seven or eight packs? Six. Let's say on the box. Four ten card packs and two exclusive five card chrome. Oh, okay. That's so, all right, so here's the I'm gonna do the chrome next. Yeah, do the do the regular first. Okay. He's Good saying luck. Saved by the Bell might be a bigger hit if we don't open any more packs. So your feedback on these cards is not really killing it, kids. I want something good. Pull uh, the rookie pack. Joey Bart. Nate Pearson. See, That's the, a rookie. Yeah, the thing, these are both rookie cards. So the thing about a lot of these are that some of them are going to be like... Xander Bogarts. Paul Goldschmidt, Josh Bell, Maximo Acosta. That looks like a prospect card, foil. I don't know. Oh, that's sweet. Word. This is a twin, Kio, Kiani Kabako. You're not going to know like a lot of these players because I didn't know a lot of the last minor players. leaguers. Taylor Trammell, uh, Shane to Baz. Tony wants a uh, uh, a screech rookie. Screech rookie. <laughs> Pre adult. Film star or post? Post. Just before he, or, or like when he went to jail. For like stabbing some fool. Is that what he went for? Yeah, he got in like a bar fight and stabbed somebody. Dustin Diamond. He, he's dead now. Guy cancer. Well, you know what? Here we are making fun of a guy that's dead. No, like, I right. don't think we're going to get haunted at all tonight. You are. We get haunted every night. It's called marriage. My wife doesn't watch this channel, so. Yeah. <laughs> Mookie Betts. Dude, this guy's Alex Bregman. Jose Abreu. Uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. Oh, that's cool. Anthony Rendon. A Robert Hassel. He could have been Ron Jeremy Selmay. That's a cool Robert Hassel card. It, oh, that's from the, okay. Arinso Reyes. Shea... We're going to go with Langoliers. Baron Laura. And Taryn Babra. So, move those over here. So, yeah. Well, this doesn't actually improve. We might just have to get more cards, bring you all back at a discounted rate. Because I can't honestly say. Maybe I should come have the wife open packs because she's always been better at pulling stuff than me. <laughs> I have her just come down. Brian Mountcastle, Christian Javier, Braylon Marquez, a Shohei Otani card. You got no Otani, right? There just There you go. Otani's been Charlie Blackman, Blaze Jordan. That's a great name. Good old Blaze. Blaze Jordan. Matthew Levitor. Reed Detmers, hit, Logan Gilbert, and Jordan Adams. Jordan Adams. He's got 87 cello packs he can donate. <laughs> oh, my God. This is depressing. We doing hockey at some point. You'll find it. God, I should just go and find my 87. We'll just rip them open. Like, oh, that one was eaten by the dog. <laughs> and sell them to Fairfield to sell to people. God. Brian Anderson, Bryce Harper, 
Yadir Molina, Francisco Lindor, J.D. Martinez, Jordan Adams. I feel like something is stuck here, but maybe it's not. Pete Crow Armstrong, Bryce Turang, Leover Paguero, and Nolan Gorman. This is a very anticlimactic box. You had me excited. I'm Remember, disappointed. Bowman's always the rookies. So, well, so you guys get this in 10 years, get back to us. Five years from now is when you're going to be like, oh, my God, like I got that Blaze Jordan. You know, or this I think Crow Armstrong, Armstrong is going to be the one I roll with. <laughs> this Christian Javier, who's won three Cy Youngs in a row. Trenton Cass. These are pretty sweet cards. They're nice looking cards. Josiah Gray. Oh, the rookie of the year favorite, Sixto Sanchez. Whoever pulled or got the Marlins, like you really must have been banking on Sixto Sanchez cards because I've seen quite a few of them. Bunch of Sixto. Those are cool. sweet cards. There's your Keone Cavaco and your Hunter Bishop. Cool. Yeah, well, if that twin is anybody good, he'll be good after they've traded after him. They trade him. After they've traded him. Some, all right, we need like a one of one something or other to get things going. Got Bruden Schumacher, Jordan Adams. We got a futurist, Giants. I don't know who this is, so I'm going to just try to. Oh, it's Marco Luciano. That does not sound like a baseball player, but rather a guy you do not want to anger. Okay. Austin Hendrick and C.J. Abrams. God, that kid looks like he's about. 15 years old. Cool card, so. Sorry, we're uh, hoping that there's something in this last and upcoming box. What, what am I missing on this, dude? Okay, check this card out. Like, yeah, there's something. You see that down at the bottom by his leg? There's like a, you see the like the word there? It's not a word, it's a C-A-S. So I bet he's got his name on his sock or something. For you guys, just above the O-N on the name, you can see that C-A. Basically, I think it's just his name on his socks or something goofy. It looks, it's a, it's a weird, let's see, somebody. Yeah, <laughs> Tony said that uh, he's going to donate next time we do a, I do a sale, <laughs> some A7 solo. You're assuming you're going to get anybody to come back after the crap you've pulled? <laughs> Well, technically I, think that, technically I let you open it. Well, that's time. true, but anything that has a Keith Hernandez that's glued to the box, it looks like it's been through. I'm sure there actually are some Keith Hernandez. 100 Day War here, like that, I don't think is my fault entirely. I feel like I've had help in failing. Oh, we're live. We had to reconnect, it looks like. I don't know if you saw that. I think we're good. Everybody give a thumbs up or something if we're doing good. Yeah, it's, they get showing that it's live still. Yeah, well, I guess it looked like we disconnected for a moment, but we should be good. So here are those. Going behind them. Yeah, here are these. And we're going to open these Chrome exclusives. Exclusives. All right, best of luck. This is like hoping you're. Yeah, 5,000 to 1 odds horse comes in. Louis Patino, Mike Trout, Louis Castillo, Cody Bellinger, Josh Donaldson, Jordan Walker, Nick Allen, Garrett Mitchell, Hugin Choi, I don't know how to do that one, um, and Bryce Jarvis. Like I'm spending my life putting cards in penny sleeves. I've been spending my cards, my life opening up cards that are like, oh god. Chris Bryant. Ooh, something in that. Anthony Santander. Good luck. Bobby Dahlbeck. Kristen Pache. Yeah, this looks like a retro card too. The uh, Kiebert Ruiz. Francisco Alvarez. It's a chrome. That's a cool card. Who's the parallel? Oh, that's no. Uh, Luis Garcia, Daniel Espino, Eddie Diaz, and Xavier Edwards. 
We got four packs left. Four packs left, and these have been more disappointing than Lisa Turtle's <laughs> love affair with Screech Poppers. <laughs> How you like when we get into a conversation about Saved by the Bell? Because I feel <laughs> like this is awful. <laughs> Casey Mize, D.B. Garcia, Jake Cronenworth, Luis Campusano, Ronald Acuna Jr., oh, Tyler okay. Callahan, Antonio Gomez, Nick York, Eusneo Diaz, and Mario Feliciano. That book in the background, The Art of Hitting by Tony Gwynn, is a book that I just decided to pull out to add to some ambiance, but obviously decided that it wasn't worth it because I put cards in front of it. Yeah, has uh, Tony, Tony's supposed to be... Uh, Shane Bieber, good luck. Kristen Yelich, Sean Murphy, Kyle Lewis, Max Scherzer, Josiah Gray, Alex, or Alec, I'm sorry, Manoa, Oswald Peraza, Julio Rodriguez, and Corbin Carroll. Down to the last two packs that are all going to be chromes. Come on. I'm just I get a, begging. Get autograph in there, man. Yeah. I have not given my art of hitting book signed by Tony Gwynn, nonetheless. That to any signed? twins to learn how to hit. Yeah, on the inside cover. Simeon Woods Richardson, Matthew Thomas. Okay, we got a green thing in the back, so that's got to be something. Hopefully, it's just not the color. Um, Matthew Thompson, Jeter Downs. Maybe it just, no, it's numbered to 99 of 225. It's try, I'm trying to get that in there, but it is numbered. There you go. You can kind of see it's 225 there. Oh, there it is. Number. 99 of 225, so good luck to Boston players and doing well. J.J. Blade and Drew Waters. Now on to the final pack. Tony, I feel you need to start providing some good vibes to people, largely because you've been negative the entire show. Yeah. Did we, we just should can't... be required reading for all twins here. <laughs> yeah. That is true. I'm not giving my book. <laughs> he was referring to the Tony Wynn book. Yeah, I know. We'll give them AOL dial-up in order to do it. All right, best of luck, guys. If not, at the very least, I hope you enjoyed our feeble banter towards one another. Can I pull it? A Minnesota twin by the name of Jordan Balazovic. Hiliot Ramos. Rookie of the Year favorite. Key Brian Hayes. Josiah Gray and Braden Schumacher. So that's probably the better card, the best card out of that pack is this rookie of the year favorites for the Pittsburgh Pirates. And so next, we have to do the. Uh, you got to do these three here. We still do the three. Uh, Where's your crazy rookies? app? I don't know what this is here. Two rookies. Okay. Hold on. I'm just going to dump. Finishing. Putting all these, and I'd like to show off kind of what our what our hits were. Here's like why are, I set this up. Um, these are our hits. These are oh, that's really the biggest hits in the that we had that I know of. Put those out there, chipper. Yeah, and those two crap ones are like, yeah, that chipper select looks like it's got some damage. But congrats to the one of I suppose the. Well, you can't really say that a one of one's not a hit, can you? So no, one of one's that's awesome. We'll move these out of the way. That Shohei Otani card, that's pretty cool. So there's those. And which one are we that yeah, card I, cool. this one's here this card here is very difficult to figure out where it should go. Uh it'll be you just put your fingers down and but there's like the players. I see three a three in a row though. Uh Mets. Is that a Brooklyn, uh, who's Ed Snyder? Ed Snyder. Ed Snyder. So it looks like Monte Irvin, Ed Snyder. My Irvin's a giant. And Bob it's Feller. Duke, Duke Snyder. It's a he's a Dodger. Oh, okay, it's actually color. Duke. Yeah, that's Duke. So right, put the three, three three down, and it just one two three. Whatever it goes. The purple. So that would have been the middle one. That would have been. So it's a Dodger again. Duke Snyder. It's a Dodgers one again. 
Yeah. Duke I'll Steiner. Do I'll do this one here. This is for either going to Cleveland or KC for this card here. Orange. We're going to go with the Royals on this card. The Royals card. Okay. This is up next. DeGrom, Bauer, and Nola. I got to find the KC card. Middle. So we're looking at the Reds. KC and this one's Reds. That's the last one. Last one. San Diego and KC. Blue, and then we'll go to San Diego. That one's going to San Diego? Okay. Yep. Um, All right, well, do you want to do the uh, uh, this little gift? This is free to all the players. Yeah, we'll do it. Is this... You're going you're gonna, to you're gonna complain about some of it for sure. Do you want to have me to hit some? Do I really want to do this if I'm going to complain about it? Because <laughs> it's fun. Plus, it's free. I always this love walking into a situation where I know I'm going to be less than thrilled. Not only that, but complaining and upset about it and then go do it. <laughs> yeah, but you're giving people something free. This is not part of the original uh, auction. I don't think they wanted some of what they paid for, let alone something free. Oh, they do. Oh, they're going to get it. Oh, God. Did I just see 90? Yeah. In there? This was another box I opened. I'm like, whatever, these players can just go to the team and I'll just send them out for free. The Don Russ cello packs. Cello? Yeah, I call them cellos because I They're make up my own words. We have Don Russ cello packs. Or are you making a goof? No, so that I'm wasn't. That's, that's so just a box. That was commentary. Open, so. These are the free ones. So, uh, again, thanks a lot for, for purchasing. Um, I'll get these shipped out tomorrow, obviously, because the post office isn't open today. Um, so, hopefully, you'll get them pretty quick. I'll also send out, you'll get the. Uh, um, uh, the number to track it, the tracking number, I'll put that on the auction. So um, you'll see how that all goes. Uh, last also chance. Um, no, the, the Don Rossello, yeah, thanks a lot for purchasing. The Don Rossellos, I'm only going to open if somebody buys them. Otherwise, I'll wait and do a Don Russ, uh opening, uh, or, or I'll do a basketball opening when I get some more basketball cards. So if anyone's interested in wanting to buy the Fat Packs, yeah, the fat packs are for sale. Uh, they are uh, fifteen each, and uh, I'll definitely send them uh, free of like free shipping for sure. So if you're looking for uh, want the fat packs, I'll definitely sell them all, um, and uh, I'll just uh, pop them on. Uh, you can either pay it through Venmo or PayPal. Those are kind of the two I accept. I don't think anybody wants to see these cards. So they were not... cool. Like that Molitor was kind of cool. There was yeah, cool... I just saw some Spaceman in there. Like, really? Oh, Jim Spaceman Lee? That's sweet, actually, too. Anyone who's a Boston fan loves that. I've never even heard of him. He's in there somewhere. Oh, like that? Wait, you just passed the Diamond Spaceman King. Lee. You just passed a Ryan, Ryan Sandberg. Yeah, Diamond well, King. that's great. I mean, Cubs fan would be like, heck yeah, I love Ryan you Sandberg. You think they care about Rhino? Yeah. Well, they do. If they don't have that card, they probably can get it on eBay for about 13 cents. Well, right. Yeah, well, like I said, I'm just, I don't. Thanks Earl for watching, Herschel, Tony. The Appreciate Bulldog. it. Oh, look, that rookie card right there. Who is it? Andy Allenson. Oh, that's good stuff right there. Like, literally, you've taken the wind out of my say. Hey, it's Scott Hatterberg, pre Oakland Athletics. Oh, Those Scott, classic he cards was the one from. Well, uh, he was in uh, Moneyball. Moneyball, yeah, that's cool. Mike Lieberthal was a Philly, longtime Philly. Julio Lugo. Julio Lugo, who's that guy? Rick Ankiel. Oh my God. Gary Matthew. Oh, Rick Ankiel. <laughs> Dude, that's that's awesome. Otis Nixon, six steals, one game, still worth about six cents. Dude, he was he was one ugly dude. <laughs> I don't think we need to be talking about ugliness with between him and uh, Willie McGee, just just bad. Chris Hammond, Charles Nagy. 
I think you should rip those one of those packs, but no, we're done because if we rip that one of those packs, I would have Toya do it. Like, get down here and open this. Hold the ball. So only Lonzo Ball? There's got to be no. There's in a there. bunch of rookies in there. I, don't, I but I'm not up to date on. Um, well, clearly, I don't think that basketball. mattered when I didn't know half these dudes. So they're all going. Who's that one? It's a Philly sticker. Oh, a Philly sticker. Sweet Phillies, you get a sticker. All right. Well, thanks a lot for uh, for watching. Um, keep it out for the uh, uh, tomorrow for the. Um, Tracking information. Yeah, the tracking number. That's going to come sometime. That Magley's kind of sweet. And I may have to help him uh, bankroll him so we can get some better chances for hit cards here. Um, largely because I'm not in it for making money because I have zero desire to keep cards. Yeah. But uh, I do like ripping them. Sadly, I wasn't able to pull anything too yeah. great for anybody. So but if you have anyone to blame, blame him. Yeah, clearly. Who's you? He had more glue on the card than he had card, but yeah, I can work with that. It was sweet. Anything else? I think we're good. I think that's it. Now we just got to sort and send. So, all right, again, thanks a lot. Uh, be sure to subscribe, like, share, do all that stuff. Uh, check out Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all under the Green Star moniker. I'm also Green Star 1987 on, uh, uh, what's it called, TikTok, and a post on there as well. So, beyond that. Yeah, we're all good. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, everyone. You want to hit the stop on there? Which one's the stop? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they... They're shooting around. I'm sure they're throwing Right. Let's back it up. <laughs>